I think we're live. Hello, 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 friends. If you are watching the stream after it is already up, I will have timestamps for you down below. Today's scream stream is a little bit different. We're doing like a scary sleepover night. It's really rainy outside with the tropical storm that rolled through. I'm currently under a flash flood warning. I don't know if that's relevant to this. Like maybe my power will go out. It's very likely actually, but I still wanted to stream if I could. So, and all my equipment is like protected and plugged in somewhere safe. Anyways, as always, I need to set up the stream. I also have something in my lip gloss. So give me a sec here and I will be right with you. Hi chat, hi to everyone coming in. Hello, hello, Amanda, hi. Hi, Blue Mind. Hey, friends. <laughs> hi, guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I was just saying, today's Scream stream is gonna be a little bit different. Okay, we should be good there. I need to get this piece of hair out of my lip gloss. We're having a sleepover, baby. Not all night, but we are having a little, oh my God, there's lip gloss on my nose. I just realized this lip gloss has truly gotten all over my face. I was trying to do a slightly more natural makeup and instead it's gotten everywhere. Hi everybody. Um, so we are doing something a little bit different for today's scream stream okay it's not gonna be a sleepover into the night you know what i mean it's gonna be like a normal length sleepover like a normal length sleepover a normal length stream but it's just so like gray and dreary here with a tropical storm it's been really wet really just like like disgusting out and all i wanted to do today was watch scary movies and like play some scary games or something like that. So I decided that for the Scream stream, that's the kind of vibe. You stopped, Gabe, you stopped watching Mother's stream to watch mine. You stopped wa watching Nicki Minaj's stream. Amanda, I love you. Hello, my love, Loey stream, Loey stream. Thanks for coming, Amanda. I love you so much. Thanks for the super chat. Um, but yeah, I thought we would have a little, a little smorgasbord of a stream because I didn't really want to like dedicate myself to doing any one thing tonight. It's kind of been a long day with the storm and everything. So we have the trop to the tropical storm. Um, luckily, actually, this is so funny. Wait, I'm going to tell you guys about my, it, oh, I'm so sorry. I thought I kicked my dog. I think God did it. I'm like wearing like uh, sweatshirt, sweatpants, like slippers. I am full on cozy. So the tropical storm um, ripped open or Hurricane Hillary, I guess. I don't know what it is now. I think it's definitely a tropical storm and it hasn't even hit Los Angeles. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is going on here? <laughs> what is going on? Thank you so much. Uh, Lexi, Lexi, <laughs> thank you so much for five gifted memberships. That's so generous of you. I love you so much, Lexi. Just seeing you in chat is is more than enough comfort for me but that's so generous thank you very very much and thank you andy cardona for the super chat happy scream stream sunday everyone stay safe with the storm loey love you i love you angie um i also saw ashes here hey ash mother let's get spooky excited to get into it um i am too it's been a long freaking day thanks for being here ash um, and then Miss Mrs. Zombie side. Hope you're safe over there. Happy Scream Stream. We're staying safe. We're staying safe. I promise. So, um, basically, when I woke up this morning, the wind had like, um, the only thing that had happened in my backyard was that like, the door to my guest house weirdly had been like ripped open by the wind. It like opens out, and literally the force of the wind had like ripped it i guess it just wasn't fully latched um no damage or anything i say ripped it out i i really should watch my words i mean it just like swung it open like there was no actual damage i'm sorry wait cosmic happy birthday hi it's me again loey thought i'd say hey wanted to inform you today is my birthday on to youtube the best beauty surprise it's loey's beauty gracing my eyes even on cosmic's birthday they're writing me beautiful incredible poetry that i can just um absolutely adore 
thank you so much for that cosmic you should not be giving me a super chat on your birthday i should be giving you the super chat on your birthday i i wherever in the world i possibly could give it to you but thank you so much for that happy birthday happy birthday to cosmic in the chat but anyways yeah the um the door was like wide open um i i think we just got a mod in um mizzy oh no blue was here as well um but so the door was open that was i mean that was fine there was no damage i was just like whoa i can't believe the wind literally like ripped my door open but obviously no damage whatever no like my patio furniture is fine like there's nothing i i had moved in like all of the things i thought would fly away basically into like my house but i had used my dyson vacuum outside really really briefly the other day i was literally using it to clean up blue mind thank you very very much for donating through tiltify friendly reminder you guys we are getting really close to the 45 uh we're, we're really close to 4500 and then we are um very close to 5000 and when we hit 5000 if we can hit 5000 before the end of the month for the make a wish stream which i have i have make a for make a wish i have make a wish link down below if we can hit 5000 i will do a scary story to tell in the dark stream we're only like six sorry we're only like six hundred dollars off from that so friendly reminder it's always linked down below um but i had left my dyson outside because i was um I was using it to get like a cobweb or something the other day so that I didn't have to walk through it. And I left my Dyson outside and it, um, where's my phone? Sorry, I, both my phones look identical right now because they both have the same kind of case on. Um, but my Dyson. I'm keeping it in the guest room so it doesn't annoy the dogs until it eventually runs out of battery and just turns off. So basically my Dyson had like been outside and I guess that like it got, um, it like short circuited and now it won't turn off. So it's in my guest room just running until it runs out of battery. And then hopefully after it dries, maybe it's fixable, but. Thanks for posting those rules. If you have a ticket open, that can be handled in the Discord. It doesn't need to come into the stream. The mods can can take care of that when they have time. Um, let me see. Thanks. Um, Thanks, Kate. Hi, Revel. Thanks for modding today. Sorry, I was pitting stuff. Um, that was why I was going quiet. But yeah, that's been the storm. Then we had an earthquake. I was in the shower when the earthquake hit. I didn't feel shit. <laughs> I didn't feel anything. I got out of my the shower and my mom had called me like four times and like my phone had blown up with all my friends. Like, did you feel the earthquake? <laughs> and I didn't feel it. Um, Hurricane, somebody said in chat. Hurricane, I'm sorry I missed whoever that was, but I saw it come up. Sorry, I'm so behind in um, super chats. Um, let me get back to that. Witchy Wolf Gaming, thanks for two months. Love you so much. Max Beats 48. Hope your day's been going well. Eating girl dinner. I hope you're eating your girl dinner. I haven't had mine yet. I don't know what I'm gonna have. It's been weird on my Sunday scream streams because for the last two Sundays, um, both of them, I've been on 75 soft. And I'm not ordering out for 75 days. Um not ordering out like when I'm home anyways like later on down the line I'm traveling and I feel like once I'm traveling and like doing things with friends like 
maybe that'll be a little bit different and I might give myself some leeway, but I want to save some money for when I travel too. So I haven't been ordering out and I haven't been getting my hibachi. So every night I end stream, I still have to like cook something. I, I never know what I'm going to do until the, the end. Um, also, I hope there's no lip gloss on my teeth. I've been like staring at myself in the viewfinder um, or in my computer because this lip gloss has been getting everywhere. Feel free to tell me if it ends up my teeth. Um, also, how cute is this sweatshirt? Uh, Philip DeFranco's company, Beautiful Bastard, they sent me this. So cute, so comfy. Danny said, Louis, please, uh, thanks for three months. Louis, please pick my next, uh, my next nail color slash design. I'm such a sucker for a pink nail, dude. I'm such a sucker for a pink nail. I literally just trimmed these down because I don't have it in me to get rid of them, even though they're so grown out already. Um, I'm going to say pink nails, but you could do a fun, you could do a pink nail with a fun, like French tip, or you could do pink French tips wait what if you did like wait wait what if you did like neon pink french tips although it's kind of, we're kind of getting into fall actually now that i think about that um i don't know i don't know what should your nails be um let's see I don't think I'm through everything, but let me, I'm trying so hard to think of good nails, like a good nail idea. I don't even know what I'm going to do for my next set, which is also why I wound up trimming these down. I honestly didn't do the best job. They're a little, they're a little short, but um, shorter than I was hoping. <sighs> what if, what if you did, what if you did like a nude base? nail with like or what if you did pink with a red french tip because that's like that's like not so summery that would be kind of cool though like a pink base with like a red tip that would be kind of fun that's what i'm saying danny evie thanks for being here i'm happy to see you I was worried about you and the pups and kitties with the tropical storm and earthquake glad you're here you're all okay thank you so much my evie darling i hope you're okay i hope you're feeling well today um, yeah, we've been all right. We've been okay. Um, uh, Riley doesn't like rain very much and he is just like a confused little old man. So he's very unhappy not being able to go outside as much as he wants. So it's been a little tough with that, but honestly, we're good. I feel very lucky that, um, we are in a place too where, uh, you know, we're not getting the worst of the storm. And honestly, my heart just goes out to everyone who, did get hit with it i you know really really hard like all the people who had to evacuate and stuff i feel so thankful that it was not an actual hurricane by the time that it's kind of gotten over here plus i think it's like fully missing us my mom said that today she was like i think like it's like going and like away from you i think we're just gonna get rain but thank you evie ali asked how my week was hi Louie, how was your week my week was okay ali i've been really busy honestly just working a ton but i'm so happy to be here for the scream stream crow said can't stay long but i'm gonna make some coffee and hang a bit heck yeah crow i got mine in my little my little starbucks holiday cup as well hi Gigi. hi 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 uh got offered a new remote job and i get to see you too perfect ending to my night let's go love you so much i love you Gigi. i'm so happy for you congratulations i hope the job is paying you everything you deserve and it's the right position and i hope that it's what you want and that you you take it if, if you want it that's so cool i'm really happy for you congratulations um, Jess, thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate you so much. And then Cosmic said that Dyson is working. It's doing the most. Maybe your house is haunted by a super clean ghost. Can you imagine my Dyson is just haunted? It's not even the rain. It's just like there's like a ghost inside of my vacuum. I am glad that like it malfunctioned from the start and it was doing what I showed you like from the minute that I brought it in like pretty much from the minute that I brought it in out of the rain got it dry it immediately turned on by itself because honestly if I just like had it out in the house and it turned on in the middle of the night and wouldn't turn off I would have gotten so freaked out 
so for example, Amanda. Amanda, I'm so happy to hear that. Amanda said that she got her job back. I'm so happy. Congratulations, my love. You also have all your furniture for your streaming room. Just waiting on the floors. Love you lots. I love you too, Amanda. I'm so happy to hear that, honey. That makes me very happy. I've been thinking about you a lot with that. And I'm so proud of you. You are, you are just such an impressive, incredible person, Amanda. And every time that you come in here with one of your life updates uh, about what you're doing, I'm just so impressed by you. So it makes me very, very happy. Um, Ali said, similarly, I can't eat out till Dragon Con. Yeah. Yeah, those... Reyna! <laughs> no! Reyna, what are you doing? Reyna, that's like... Reyna. Reyna! Oh my god. Thank you so much for 20 gifted memberships. That's so generous. I just remember you gifted 20 the last stream, too. You're so sweet, Reyna. Thank you so much for all your support. Talk about somebody I love hearing from in chat. I love you very much. That's so generous of you. Thank you, thank you. Um, But Ali, yeah. Those imaginary, like, rules, rules you set on yourself because, like, eating out is just so pricey they're so worth it i've saved so much money since i stopped eating out so much money and i've been eating so much better i've been eating way more nutritious foods like i also am like aware of how much i'm eating slash how little like before when i would order out for like two to a meal a day like maybe two meals a day sometimes it just would i would have no concept of what i was eating and i i feel so much better now but more importantly, I'm saving money <laughs> until <laughs> I get to travel. Um, Jess said, the first time I've got you live. Hi from New Zealand. Hi, Jess. Thanks for being here. And then Summer, thanks so much for popping in for the Scream stream. Thanks for your super chat, your first one ever. Hey, Digi. You just got back from camping in time for stream. Heck yeah. Excited to hang out tonight. Love you, babes. I love you too, Digi. Thanks for being here. I hope camping was good and you didn't get rained out or anything. Alicia Rose, thanks for 21 months. I'm glad you're here for the stream stream. Raina, thank you again for 20 gifted. Gigi did take the job. Oh, yay. Oh, that makes me very happy. Congratulations, honey. That's awesome. And let your wife know I say hello as well. I send I send you guys love right back. And then Summer, thank you so much for the, the super chat. I, yeah, same, same Summer. Thank you for both of those super chats. Hello, this is the very first live I've ever made it to. I'm so happy to finally be here. Hope everyone is doing well. We are so far just catching up. I'm rambling. Okay, I feel like I'm finally caught up. Oh, Colin, thank you so much for one month. Happy to be here. These streams are comforting. That makes me very happy to hear. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thanks for thanks for a month, too. Kelly said I'm looking unfathomably hot tonight. Really? Really? Thanks. I looked really sexy last night, actually. I uh, I was at a birthday party last night, and the theme was emo. And I, I, Chloe was in full effect. My friend answered the door, and he goes, oh, hello, Chloe. I ha This isn't even Facetune. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, my God, it's so washed out. What the heck? I look like, I look like that Jeff the Killer meme. <laughs> Why does it look like that? Um, I looked really good last night is what I was going to say. I didn't feel like doing like my whole makeup again today. Um, but all the black is like, it's impossible for you guys to see it on camera. I was like wearing black. I had black hair. My makeup was all smoky and black. Yes. Yes. All of you giving Reyna her flowers in chat. I love her so much. I love Reyna. But thank you, Kelly. And thanks for 14 months. Livia, happy birthday! Well, happy belated birthday. Livia said, have, uh, best belated birthday present ever. So it's Cosmic's birthday today, and Livia's maybe like a day or two or however long ago, a, a belated birthday present. Listen, my birthday was in May. Belated birthday presents galore. So, <laughs> uh, per birthday presents being you guys' presents in my street. You, you get what I mean. You get what I mean. No, I'm not putting Reyna in jail. I can't do that to Reyna. I, I can't do that. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, 
I can see. Um, I truly just, it was a really good look. Here's a photo of me and my friends. Maybe you'll be able to see my outfit a little bit better. My friend Mark posted it on his Instagram, but oh yeah, you can see my look there much better. Way better. Okay, that's what I looked like last night. So, uh, like, the makeup was makeuping. Like, I spent so long getting ready. I'm honestly, I always forget I'm pretty decent at makeup when I put a little bit of effort into it. Because I'm so lazy <laughs> when I get ready. But. How do I... Where's my live control? Oh, there it is. Why couldn't I find that? There we go. Okay. Um, Ireland Winker. <laughs> Hi, Loey. I'm so happy I finally caught one of your lives. This is my first one. Keep being amazing. Thank you so much. You too, Ireland. Thanks for being here. And thanks for your first ever super shot. I really appreciate it. It means the world that you're here tonight. So please enjoy your stay. Welcome to the Scream stream. Today is going to be kind of like cozy vibes. We should set the self-care timer No. We should definitely set the self-care timer. Okay, if this is your first stream, we have a rule because ever since I started streaming like once a week, um, we, I, I like to make sure we're taking little breaks. You know what I mean? Like I like to make sure we're not sitting for too long, we're hydrating, we're eating food, like we're making sure we're good. So I'm gonna go ahead and set the self-care timer to an hour from now. Cause you guys don't like when I forget to do it and I my body also doesn't like when I forget to do it, so. Summer, welcome to the channel memberships. And also, Jenny1986, welcome to the channel memberships. I know there were so many people who also just got gifted memberships. So if you did get one tonight, don't forget there is a members only tab here on YouTube. Um, and I have like members only videos and stuff like that. So I just know sometimes like people will, you know, they'll become a member and they don't know they get all this extra stuff. So I wanna make sure you guys know. But thank you both Summer and Jenny. Um, Evie said tonight is one of those nights when my pup is arguing with her ghost sister and boy, it's hectic. I love my dog barking at my four-year-old ghost. I'm honestly, that sounds about right. <laughs> Just your dog and the four-year-old ghost that lives in your house arguing. I honestly, sometimes when like my dogs get really worked up, I'm like, what are you, what are you experiencing? Like, what do I not, what do I not know? Um, ooh. Hikate, I just saw your, um, your message on Discord. I will. I think, um, we're probably gonna play Faz at some point tonight. I need to update the game. Um, thank you, Evie dear. Amanda! I think Loey and I are sharing a birthday week is iconic. I agree. I will put you in prison. I'll put you in there. You stop it. But I also agree that sharing a birthday week is iconic of us. Go us, actually. Good May. Good good May energy, you know. Jenny! Jenny1986, thanks again for joining the channel memberships, and thank you so much for your super chat. Hey, Loey, first time live, and I'm so excited. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm so happy you made it. Happy to have you here. It's gonna be a fun, um, it's gonna be a really fun stream tonight, I think. We're doing some different stuff, but I think it'll be good. Maggie, hi, how are you? Thank you so much for two months, my darling. I missed you. Welcome back. I hope you've been doing well. We're honestly just trying to get through life on this end of things, so. <laughs> I hope you're well. Morgan C. Only thing I love about Sundays is Scream Stream. I love you so freaking much, Morgan. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you had a good week. And thank you very much. Honestly, my, my Sunday ritual of the Scream Stream is so deeply important to me at this point. It is so crucial to my mental health. Um, sorry, I, I, 
You guys are so fast tonight. There's so many super chats. You're very generous. Thank you very much. It's never necessary, but it is so deeply appreciated, of course, and, and I just appreciate your support very much. It's all, whatever I can't keep up, I feel so bad. Um, there is a piece of hair in my lip gloss. Ash Maiden, the Ash Maiden, thanks for your first ever super chat. Hi, Loie, glad to, to hear you're doing okay after the earthquake. <laughs> I won't be here, oh my god, sorry, for long because I'm up at 4 a.m. for work, but I'm happy to listen to you while I draw my D&D characters. I would love to hear about your D&D characters sometime if you ever want to tag me in your drawings somewhere. I mean, if you feel comfortable sharing them, of course. But thank you very much for that. I am doing okay. It's been kind of a crazy week. Uh, but, you know, what can you do? What can you do except to live through the earthquake to tell the tale? You know? I just love that the tropical storm wasn't enough. The whole ass hurricane was not enough. Maggie May, oh, thank you very much for that super chat. Hey, hon, I took a mental health break and I'm so glad to be back. I hope you're doing well, honey. I, I, I really, really, really do hope you're well. And then I saw your second one saying that Emma says hi and she missed you too. I was thinking about you and Emma recently. Hi, Emma. Hi, Miss Maggie May. Thank you guys for popping in and saying hi today. That means a lot to me. And I, I hope you're doing really well and taking care of yourselves. Blue Mind, thanks for four months. I'm so pumped for tonight. Love and light to you. Thank you, my darling. And then Cosmic, welcome to the channel memberships. Oh my God, I'm so very honored. Cosmic, please watch my video I just did for the channel members. It's, we, uh, we watched um, uh, this true crime documentary over the course of like a couple of weeks, actually. It's like half me having like a mental breakdown and dyeing my hair purple and then half, like true crime video you know so yeah <laughs> pop over there and watch it it's fun and it's long it's really long thank you again maggie may and then digi said i went to a ghost concert friday night not sure if you're into their music but my stars it was amazing try out their music if you're into alt i feel like i've seen a lot about ghosts they're the ones with like the their lead singer i need to get back up my second chat so I, I can't read everything. Um, how strong was the earthquake? I, I thought it was like a magnitude four. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I didn't feel it. I didn't feel anything. I was in the shower. I heard the dogs bark. I came out of the shower. I had so many like messages from my, like my mom had called me. I had all these text messages. And I was like, I literally didn't feel anything. My friends in other parts of LA did feel a lot though. Like I have friends pretty much all over LA, of course. Hi, sweetie, I'm sorry. You can lay back down here. Oh my goodness, you're still so wet from the rain. Oh my goodness. Oh, good job. Very good boy, huh? Yes, you are. The dogs are very sleepy from all the rain. But yeah, like got out of the shower, was just like, what happened? <laughs> it was more just like crazy that there had also been an earthquake. But um, nothing was off the shelves, anything like that. It was just, it's crazy. Um, but ghosts, sorry, ghosts. Um, are they the ones with that lead singer who, um, the Pope guy, he like dresses up as a Pope and that's like the character? Why do I, why am I getting a bumble notification? <laughs> I don't want to be on that godforsaken app. Um, but I will have to check it out. Jess, welcome to the channel memberships. Okay, then, hey. I love you, okay, then. Okay, then. <laughs> That's the nicest message. Thanks for being encouraging in ways my parents never were, lol. I am your parent. I, you are my child. I've adopted you now. If your parents aren't supportive of your shit, I'm here. I'm, I'm here and, and I make the rules and fuck that. I'm always happy to see you as well. Actually, we're watching a couple of different um, scary videos tonight, but I'm thinking about in a stream in the future, just opening it up with no idea of what we'll watch and like taking suggestions from you guys or maybe starting a Google Doc forum, like before we do that stream and like watching videos from you guys. I also know like there are ways for you to send in videos to play, but I don't really know how to do that. Anyways, thank you, okay, then I love you. Amanda, 
Super chatting until a, my bank puts a hold on my... No! Just like I do with Drew. Go give him your money. Go give, go give Drew your super chats. I literally will start plotting right now. I'm sorry. I'm looking something very important up. Actually, my favorite Polly Pocket account has a cute little Luna Polly Pocket thing that she just made, like from Sailor Moon. Amanda, you can actually go in there. It looks real cozy. It looks real cozy. Like, look at that. Hold on. Let it. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Slay. It's, it's so overexposed, but I think you could go in there if you wanted to. Um... I will put you in there. I you are you're in jail, Amanda. You are in super chat jail. Raina, thank you so much for that super chat. You are way too generous to me. Ending the weekend with a scream stream makes the last day before going back to work much less ugh. <laughs> Love chilling and uh, writing while hanging with everyone feels like a hangout with friends. That makes me very happy. It feels like a hangout with friends for me too. I definitely like miss these streams when I don't get to do them. So I, I love that it feels like that for you guys, too. Maggie, thank you so much for five gifted memberships, my darling. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's very generous. Wow, lots of new members today. Um, But I totally understand. It is just bittersweet because it's like, damn, the minute the scream stream is over, I got to start prepping for work tomorrow. Oh, you know, YouTube and stuff like that. But I've actually been, most of this week has been spent writing. I've been writing a lot of scripts for YouTube. Like, I think I said that on in my, what was that, Thursday? Thursday, maybe? Um, My Thursday stream? It wasn't Friday, it had to have been Thursday. But. Um. Sorry, I was saying how long I've been live, about 30-ish minutes. Well, we'll probably, I should probably post it on live, but I'll get through these first. Um, but yeah, writing a lot of scripts for YouTube videos. I have another scary side, another like mega scary side of TikTok compilation. Do you guys want to know a secret? I was really, I was truly going to keep this a secret from you. I truly was. Last, last time I streamed, which was, I think, Thursday, I was like, teehee. I've been working really hard, but no, you can't know what I'm working on. Stop it. Stop it. Please, please. Like just, I was so adamant. I would not tell you. I have one 50 TikTok video coming out probably within the next like week and a half. And then I'll have a second 50 TikTok video coming out probably in the, like a two-ish weeks after that. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm excited. It's taken a lot of work to get that kind of stuff together, but I love the idea of like making like larger compilations like that. I just, you guys responded really well to the first one. It has more views, I feel like, than my videos have in a really long time, but also more importantly than that, it was so fun for me to make. Uh, it was honestly the first video in a long time I had had that much fun making. Um, so I'm so excited. That means you guys are getting a hundred TikToks, a hundred TikToks in the next month. And oh my God, I'm so excited. It's going to be so fun. Um... Momo said Louie hi. Anyways, that's what I've been up to. That's what I've been up to is feeding my children tea. Um, oh, friendly reminder, you guys, check out the um, check out the pinned rules up top. I need to write those actually, but I my computer's acting funny. I'll have to do that in a second. But make sure to reference the the rules at the top of the stream if you want to hang out and chat. Listen to the mods. I appreciate you all. But Momo said, Loey, hi, I've seen both of the short films in your thumbnail. I'm excited to watch them with you. Happy Scream Stream. I've only watched one of the short films I'm going to watch with you guys today, and I've only watched part of it, but I'm so excited. It'll be so much fun. 
Um, but yay, I'm glad you've seen them, Momo. And then Jose said it'd be cool if you watch my football glitch. I'll have to do that whenever um, we do like, like the sending in scary vids. Molly said your journey with 75 Soft and 369 expired, inspired me to do them too. You first talked about it the day I realized I needed to make changes. It was a sign. Molly, that makes me so freaking happy. I honestly, it has been, it is just such a game changer when you actually prioritize yourself. Like in any capacity for so long, I've avoided making changes that I like wanted to make just because I, I, I don't know, I was scared, but like, having a challenge having like routine helps my brain so much so i hope it's helped yours too um maggie said i watched your old videos and i didn't know about chaos and i can relate i'm assuming you mean kansas did you live in kansas as well did you live in kansas as well is that what chaos means <laughs> the way that i lived in that whole ass state and i don't remember what what it was i was talking about living in kansas the other night actually it's crazy. I moved from Georgia to Kansas, Kansas to Texas, Texas to LA, LA back to Georgia, then Georgia back to LA. <laughs> that has been that has been my 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 moving journey. Um But yes. Also, if you guys don't know what 369 is, what Molly brought up, so 75 soft is like a 75 day challenge I'm doing just like um basically abiding by like these rules i've set up for myself i'm just trying to make better habits essentially like writing and reading every day that kind of thing um one sec Um, what was I just talking about? Oh, 369 though. 369 is a manifestation technique and I need to start doing it because I'm manifesting every single day. And right now it's just like my traditional like scripting manifestation, but 369 is such a good manifestation method. All you do is write down your manifestation three times in the morning, six times in the afternoon and nine times at night. It works so well so well so well i'm telling you i've never not manifested every time that i do it be careful what you manifest with 369 because oh my god it is not playing around um and then cosmic oh again with another poem you are hitting me right in the heart tonight loey slay her face is beat for the gods everyone in chat let's show some love to the mods especially normie in particular that's so real cosmic and so true love to the mods tonight and always the mods are always here of their own volition and completely voluntarily and uh i just appreciate them so much if you do we still have actually maria that's so true the 369 girls do want to drink wine do we still have mod applications open if we do the mods will put the um the discord link i'm sure in chat whenever they have a sec um but I know we were looking for, for more hands on deck. Love to the mods, they've been awesome. Just the best in the world. Hey Max, hi honey. Um, And then Samantha, oh my goodness, Stav, Stav, Stavropoulos? Samantha Stav, Stavropoulos, I'm so sorry if I butchered that. I'm currently watching Cape Fear from 1991. Oh my God, that sounds like a terrifying plot. I've never heard of this though, Cape Fear. I do, of course, love Scream, which I think is your yeah, it is your um your thumbnail photo. That sounds like a very scary concept. I I hope it doesn't give you nightmares. But thank you so much for that, um, Samantha. And then the Ash Maiden said curtain D and D characters are a homebrew 5e witch void. I'm not sure how to say that word. A fae touched tiefling druid a galaxy tree you are so detailed a galaxy tiefling rouge 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 rogue rouge what was i talking about rogue sorry 
a pink Owlin rogue and a prismatic changeling bard and throws money at you. <laughs> the way that you did that and that I literally butchered every single thing that you said. I have only played D&D &D one time. I have one character. She's amazing. I love her so much. Do you guys want to hear about my D&D &D character? Um, her name is Soleil and she's so cute. I'm telling them this just for you, Ash Maiden. Um, her name is Soleil and she is a cleric and she's a little, she's a little, um, a little elf and she like worships the sun. Like her biggest fear is like being in the dark and that's like a lot of her like lore. Um, and she honestly, she's like, I've only played a horror campaign with her. So I really focus on that portion of her personality and like, like what are her fears but like I want to play with her again because I've, I've never like fully fledged her I mean I fledged her out and um my friend even like drew her for me and stuff but she's really pretty so is like she has like blonde hair and the blonde hair goes into orange which goes into red but it's not even just like blonde it's like yellow it's like vibrant yellow one day I should um one day I should cosplay as her I thought about doing it for the um for the red pair and then I did it. Maggie Mae, thank you again for five gifted. Keisha Brenda Mole, thank you so much for five gifted memberships. That's so sweet. Amanda, after sending me more money, said I followed that account on Insta after you sent me the Phantom of the Opera Polly Pocket. So I can't even like give you jail cells from there anymore because you, you already know them all. What am I gonna do? I guess I have to get more creative. I would love to see the artwork. I would have to ask my friend for permission and also find it. I don't know where it is, but um, I should get artwork made of Soleil or like draw her myself. I'm not very good at art though. <laughs> I really, I like art a lot though. Like I love to paint. I love to draw, but I, I'm not, I do not have a natural talent for it in any capacity, like at all. I used to be so like envious of people that could draw. Summer, thank you so much for five gifted. Thank you very much, my darling. I love you so much. Summer, guys, what is with all the gifted memberships tonight? This is so generous. We have like 50 new, we have 51 new members. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. Uh, Keisha Brendamel, gifted five. And then Summer gifted five. And then Ren gifted five. Thank you all very much for all of those gifted memberships. There's a hell of a lot of members in this chat now. That's crazy. Thank you guys very, very much. Um, Max asks, thoughts on 1989 TV, also Not Your Normal Kid Show. I'm excited for 1989 TV. And then also the Not Your Normal Kid Show, the new eps that have come out. Um, they look really, really cool. They look fun. Like they, I, I'm into it. I don't know. I have some thoughts on the plot and like some, um, some kind of, um, <laughs> wait. Why are there so many gifted memberships? Jesus Christ. What is going on? What is going on? What is going on? Guys. Guys. D did you guys like orchestrate this? Is everyone just giving out memberships? What is happening? Jinxie, thanks for five gifted. And then my Evie, dear. Thanks for five gifted. This is so generous of you. We have 62 total new members tonight. That is wild. Um, but not your normal kid show. Yeah, I have some thoughts on how the new episodes affect, like, my theories and stuff, but I haven't made them. I'm gonna try to get through these so I can post on Instagram and stuff. Evie said, extra fun when Minnie, my pup, starts growling at the ceiling. Zoe, my little girl, is never anywhere near the ceiling, and arguments are sibling-like. Who's up there? I don't know. My medium eyes can't see them. Maybe that's for a reason. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm sure you probably think that as well. Maybe it's just because you're dogs. Maybe, maybe it's someone who doesn't want you to see them and, and who just really loves the pups. You know what I mean? But I love that, you know, hopefully they feel safe with the dogs. I don't know. Growling at the ceiling, though. I'm I'm assuming that's not the four-year-old little, little girl, actually. Never mind. <laughs> maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. Maggie said I love your hair slay. Thank you, babe. Thank you, thank you. Old Kaven said I put all my spooky vids on the spooky media on Discord. Ooh, yay! Okay, yay, you'll be lurking. Okay, okay, okay. Also, Jinxie, thanks for a month. Amber Jade and uh, Viv Viviana, 
Uh, Vale, thanks for joining the channel memberships. Welcome, welcome. Caitlin Rivera, Rivera, sorry. Can't wait for the movies. My homeowners association is letting us put the window AC units back. Let's go. That makes me so happy to hear, dude. Thank God. Thank God. The cat's pant no longer. I'm so happy to hear that. I've been thinking about you ever since I got my AC fixed, actually. I was, I was wondering if that had ever gotten resolved for you. And I'm so happy. So happy to hear that you guys have some AC in there. Um, also, <laughs> Maggie, I, I get it. I, thanks for, thanks for that super chat. I get it, dude. Yeah. I moved all over the country for a little while. My, my past life. <laughs> Raina also said we're going to get a D&D &D stream. Uh, or we need a D&D &D stream. No, we really do. We really do. If I could find anyone to play D&D &D with me on stream, I so would. I would be here. Good night, Maria, if you're still here. Love you so much. Amber Jade, you're an angel of light. Thank you. Making boys tears earrings. Love that. Slay. Where can I buy them? Amber, quickly, can I buy them somewhere? Can I make, can, can I, can I buy your boys tears earrings? I want to wear them. <laughs> that sounds so fun. Allison Rose Love, thanks for joining the channel memberships. And Jinxie. Jeez, thanks for five more gifted members. What the heck? Jinxie, you're going in the poly pocket. J oh my god, please. What's happening? Oh my god. Um. Jinxie, you've done a lot tonight, so... You also can go into a Sailor Moon themed Polly Pocket jail cell. That's where you go. Ash Maiden, thanks for your super chat. Love, love, love bug. I was going to say love bug. And then I thought I was about to sneeze. And then I didn't. <laughs> Thank you, honey. Allison Rose, love us. I'm so happy I don't have work tonight. I'm excited to catch the live. I'm happy you're here. Thanks for making it. Thanks for spending your Sunday with us. You guys are doing a lot tonight. You're, you are, you are doing so much. And I am just like my brain. I am such a mom brain. I'm just sitting here like, what are my children plotting right now? Like what, what are all these gifted memberships? Like, why are you guys like being so nice to me? And you just like are hanging out with me and love me and we're just friends who are chilling and watching horror movies together like i don't know why i do that i'm just like what are you plotting like <laughs> because i say that because maggie just gifted five memberships thank you so much maggie Jeez, thank you thank you thank you guys and then summer said so happy to be part of this community we're happy to have you summer and honored Katie Bug, thanks for a month. I love you so much. Thank you for existing. Amanda also said that uh, she volunteers to play D and D with me. Honestly, uh, Drew was talking to me about that the other night. We need to play D and D. Or D and D. Oh my God! No, it is D and D. I was saying, I was talking about D B D. Oh my God. D and D would be so much fun, dude. D and D would be so much fun. We all need to play D B D sometime. One night, like, it just needs to be, like, DVD central. I don't know how I could play with everyone with DVD, but that would be so fun. If I could play with you guys in DVD. Um, okay, let me put out that I'm live, because we're probably getting up on time here. Let me get started. Spooky sleepover. You guys are so sweet. You do not, you, you simply do not need to send in so many super chats, but you are so kind and so very generous. It is never necessary, but I so appreciate your support. I'm just overwhelmed by the love tonight. Completely overwhelmed. Thank you so much. I will, I will continue to read, I swear. Uh, 
um, oh my god, sorry, I just realized my little text thing is on, keeping me cozy. Okay, there we go. Okay, I just need to tweet it out, exit out, whatever. Never not call it Twitter, I don't know. Um, one sec, one sec, one sec. Make sure you guys are listening to the mods, please. I have the rules pinned. I will rewrite those in a second mod. Sorry about that. Um, but make sure we're abiding by those rules. Those are the rules of my chat. And be nice to the mods, please. <laughs> Pretty please. Should be good. And then I'm make sure. Okay, we're good. Alrighty. I've done all my tasks. Ren said D, D honestly seems so fun. Never played. Um, but I've watched my friends play it. Uh, you never played before, you watch your friends play it. Lo, you're really sweet. I'm glad you found your stream. I love you, Ren. Thank you so much. I love D D. I've only played the one campaign, and I played it over the course of like it was probably like a nine-ish hour campaign. We probably played it, uh, in, in, in addition to creating our characters, it probably took us three different sessions to get through it. To get through it, but it was so fun. I want to do it again. Delina Doomcat said, I've been running my own tabletop games lately. Wait, does that mean you're like the, like the, like the math, what are, what are they called? The dungeon master? The, like the one who like runs them or whatever. That's so cool either way. Well, whatever you mean by it, but I think that's really cool. One day, one day, <laughs> I'll get there where I can run them for my friends. Raina also said if anyone is mean to the mods that she will physically fight them in a Wendy's parking lot. And I do not condone violence, but I can't control what Raina does. You know what I mean? So like be, I, I would be nice to the mods if I were you guys. It's not a threat. It's true. <laughs> um, yeah, be nice. Um, Jinxie said, I volunteer for Lowy Jail, Lowy D&D, &D, and aging myself. But I used to play with the OG Polly Pockets. I didn't even get to play with the OG Polly Pockets. My parents didn't give them to me until they were the rubber, like, 2000s ones. I think they were too afraid I would swallow them prior to that. I love you very much, Jinxie. Thank you again for all your support tonight. It was very generous of you, but thank you, thank you, thank you. I volunteer myself to to put you into a Polly Pocket jail. Actually, since knowing now that you like the, the actual vintage Polly Pockets. So every time that I assign a jail cell, <laughs> it comes from this um, Instagram account called Polly, Polly Thur? Polly Thur? Um... And it's this incredible artist. She does these um, customized Polly Pockets. She doesn't even, like, she does sell them, but she has to, like, raffle them off. She's so popular. Okay, I'm going to let you have this one. This might not be even be one she redid. This might just be one from her collection, but I think it's a Little Mermaid one. Wait, let's see what's in. Oh, yeah. Jinxie, there you go. That's it for you. Yeah, I like that. Very into that. That's cute. Okay. Uh, Viviana, I said I've been watching you. I've 
Viv Viviana Vale. <laughs> I watched you for four years and I'm finally able to catch a live. Love you. Love you so much. Thanks for making it. That means the world to me. And thanks for your first super chat. The Ash Maiden also said, okay, last super chat. <laughs> um, last message didn't send in the other one, but your cleric and galaxy and my galaxy team, Celine, would definitely get along. Celine is in love with the moon. Yeah. Soleil like loves the sun. Like she worships like multiple, like, sorry, sweetie. Um, like deities associated with the sun. Oh my god. Oh my god, that would be so fun. Imagine Soleil and Celine, queens, icons. I can already see the fan art. I love them so much. One day, one day we'll play D&D on stream. I don't know how we'll do it. You know, have you guys, do you guys watch Doug Doug? Do you watch Doug Doug? Because he's probably my favorite creator right now. I guess he's more of like a streamer than like a traditional YouTuber. His, um, his YouTube stuff is usually just like edited down of like his streams, but he had his chat play a very simplified D&D one time. And he's like a, he, he's like a, he, he can code and stuff. So I think he somehow did it, but I thought that would be so fun if I could ever figure out a way to do it. I should probably run a single D&D &D campaign in real life though, before I just like open myself up to it and try to do it with you guys or do it on stream. Maddie Grace, thanks so much for the super chat. I've been watching for years and I love you. I love you more. And then um, Sheb Superdoc, thanks for your super chat. Oh, and Maddie, thanks for your first ever super chat. Thanks for your first ever super chat too, Sheb. Big Poppy Martinez, thanks for your first ever super chat. Hi, Louie, me, my bestie. Love you so much. We've been watching you for years. Years, sorry. If you could say hi to Easton, that would make her life. Hi, Easton. You got a real good best friend and Big Poppy Martinez. <laughs> Hi guys, thanks for watching me for so long. That's so sweet. That's so nice. I love you. Um, Emma Moscovium? I'm so sorry. Welcome to the channel memberships. Wait, what is that? I don't know, Maggie, I was just reading your, your super chat and I don't know anything about this. The UFO, oh, the UFO hearings and stuff. Okay, that's what that means, the UAP disclosure. I need to look further into it. I wanna do a video about it while it's still relevant too. And I just like kept pushing it off and haven't looked into it at all. Um, But I should, thank you for reminding me. Super Sam, thanks so much for three months. Super Sam 1397. Colby said, such a bright light in this world. You are so sweet and deserve eternal happiness and love. Best channel! You say that. You say that when youtube.com slash snitchery exists. That's so sweet of you. Thank you so much, Colby. I love you very much. You deserve eternal happiness and love. You deserve all the good things in the world. That's so nice of you. Thank you. Christy Quick said, you're such a light on my dark days. Love you to bits. Love your videos. Love your whole vibe, you beautiful woman. This is my second live. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy second live. We're so happy to have you here. It never fails to amaze me that I look through my super chats and not a single one is like, okay, like get to it. You know what I mean? They're all just like, hi, I love you. I've been watching you for my entire life, by the way. Like have known you my whole life. Love you very much. Like what the heck? What the heck? You guys just wishing me love and light. I love you. Um, thank you again, Christy. And welcome. You're beautiful. I love you. Momo said, everyone say thank you, mods. We don't deserve your grace and majesty, mods. So true, Momo. Amanda said, what color should I dye my hair? Purple. 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 Let's match. Let's match. Um, Momo, thanks so much for the gifted. Jinxie said, you want to play D&D &D in a stream? Hit, you, hit me up. Got you, lovely. Thank you, honey. I really, I will, I'll, I'll, I'll have to put something out whenever I figure out. It would be so fun to do a horror campaign, right? It would be so fun to do a horror campaign, and especially to do it before, like, the end of October. Like, to do it around Halloween time. I think that'd be fun. Maggie Mae said, please do a video on the, the, um, the UFO stuff. Plus the whistleblower is hot. Say less, bestie. Say less. <laughs> Gia Skoma said, this is the first time I've ever gotten to see the live. I've been watching you since I was in middle school. 
you know, sometimes I hear things like that and I feel really old, but I'm just honored that you have liked me for that long, Gia. That means the world to me. And that you wanted to catch a live after watching me for that long. Thank you so much for being here tonight. And thank you for your super chat. I really appreciate that. And then Karen Beth said, I love watching your videos. I love you, Karen. Thanks for making it. I hope this isn't too loud when I sit here and screw around with my spoon. I have to stir my coffee constantly when I drink it. I also want to make a tea. Is I well with Eleanor coming back anytime soon? I miss y'all. We miss you so much. We are plotting. We are scheming. You, you will have updates from us in the world of IUL so soon and I'm sorry it's taken a while we've been just figuring it out we wanted to come back with a plan obviously um and let you guys know what was up and 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 we also had to go through a bunch of you know a bunch of waiting a bunch of waiting um so yeah I wish I could have told you what was happening the whole entire time because when you see what we've been up to, you're going to be very, 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 very excited. I promise we miss you. The podcast misses you. Um, yeah, I can't say much more, but I, I promise you it's coming and we miss you and we love you. Um, and then Cosmic said she celebrates our highs and helps when we can't rest. I can think of a million reasons why Loey is the best i love you so much i love you cosmic why are you writing me poetry on your birthday get in jail go into the poly pocket house do it right now um iris says section asked about the fnaf movie um i don't think i can talk about the fnaf movie i believe it's from a struck studio but what i could talk about um i think it's from a struck studio right hold on let me double check is it? Yeah, it's definitely from a Struck Studio. Um, so can't chit chat about that due to the SAG strikes um, and not wanting to cross picket line there. But what I could talk to you about is the incredible A24 horror film, Talk To Me, which is uh, not a Struck Studio. A24 has agreed to the terms of the SAG strike. They are very cool. And Talk To Me is a great horror film from a group of YouTubers, Raka Raka, who I've watched for years and years and years. I say a group, but they're two brothers. Um, absolutely incredible. My friend Anthony just did an interview with them as well. Uh, he kept talking about how good the movie was and I wound up seeing it with uh, some friends and it was really, really, really incredible. I think it's just like a really good horror movie if you wanna see one right now, but I'm sorry for curving your question about FNAF. We stand with SAG, though. But hopefully, fingers crossed, things eventually get resolved. And, um, you know, we we can chit-chat about stuff like that again. I, I think it's crazy. I think it's asinine that these studios have not come to their senses yet. It's it's insanity to me. Um, okay. All right, all right, all right. We've hit the hour mark. Let's go ahead... And I think I'm caught up. Let's watch these movies I have for you guys today. We do have a little horror movie night to get to. A little spooky, spooky, spooky vids. Oh, really quickly, sorry. I wanted to read um, Blue, Blue Mind, I believe, donated to the Tiltify campaign for Make-A-Wish. Yes, you did. Uh, Blue Mind said, top of the evening to you, McQueen. You look amazing as always. I want to send you, uh, send lots of love and light to you. Um, I want you to take care and I want you to know I love you. Thank you for being amazing. I love you very much, Blue Mind. Thank you so much. Friendly reminder, you guys, we are still raising money for Make-A-Wish America. There are additional uh, donations coming in from the AdSense that was on our initial, um, our initial, uh, uh charity stream but i do have i have a i have a perk at five thousand and we're only like five hundred dollars and some change like 570 off from five thousand but if we can get there we'll do a scary story to tell in the dark live stream so tiltify uh the make-a-wish campaign is linked down below 
Um, again, we have way more coming in from my community. Also, the fundraising event has already hit where it's where it's at, but it would still be fun uh, where it's at. What the fundraising event has already hit its goal. We're over fifty one thousand dollars from Make a Wish from all the creators who live streamed and fundraised and did all that kind of stuff. So I think that's really cool. Um, but yeah, just a friendly reminder. <laughs> you Maggie Mae. Thank you for being here. I hope you're doing good. I hope you're good. Oh yes, SAG is Screen Actors Guild. Okay. So, um, we are going to watch, ooh, we may add a fourth. I just saw this other movie that I keep meaning to watch. Oh, we might watch a fourth. Oh, man, we might watch a fourth horror movie. Let's see. Let's see. Because I still want to play, like, Phasmophobia and stuff like that. Um, Basically, I thought that actually because, you know, we're not, we're, we're not talking about a lot of, like, big blockbuster productions right now, why not highlight some really cool indie horror short films and stuff on YouTube? Uh, we have three, maybe four, that I want to share with you guys. I think it's going to be four. I, I've always wanted to watch this. Yeah. I saw this recently in, um, in, uh, I want to say 8-Bit Ryan's video. He, he reacted to this. Um, it's from, oh crap. Should we start with this? I think we are. I think we're going to, I just got so excited about this. All right, all right, all right. Um, let me swap you guys over. We also, about a 15 minute warning until our um our mentee health break let me do here okay so this is from grumbled entertainment this is literally the short film that i just saw recommended in this video and had to immediately be like oh i've always wanted to watch this um i saw this featured in i think one of ape at ryan's videos but it's from grumbled entertainment and it was featured on night mine's annual candy bowl i think that that's like um a little collection of night mine's channel you guys are probably familiar with nick nocturne night mind um he like always is featuring like spooky stuff on his channel and i think that the the candy bowl is like a collection of like scary um, stuff from creatives and yeah I just always wanted to watch this it's also um I don't want to I don't want to spoil too much it's also animated it is animated so let's see where the volume is at I've heard great things about this I watched Ryan react to a tiny bit of it and I found it fascinating so yeah i'm excited wait before we get started sorry i saw there was one other thing that came in crow forgot to tell you i dyed my hair purple last week let's go crow i bet you look so stinking cute um I bet you look so freaking cute with purple hair, twinnies. Also, Christy Quick, thanks for your super chat. I just got done watching your last video with the ghosties, and I keep seeing your sweet Dolly's face going blurry. Spooky stuff. I'm telling you, dude, I think um, the ghosts have been kind of loud this week. I I don't know what it's been, but hold on. Let me put my menti health timer. Let's see where the volume's at here. I think Corey Kenshin. God, what? I love Corey Kenshin. I should have Once known upon that. upon a star, there lived a boy named Kalen. He was a happy little tot of six years old. And on his... I think right there, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Um, Maddie Grace asks, have I seen The Haunting of Hill House and The Haunting of Bly Manor? I actually worked with Netflix for the release of Haunting of Bly Manor. I have a very soft spot for that that film, or that film, what, for that TV show. I do watch both The Haunting of Hill House and The Haunting of Bly Manor as, like, big jumbo films, though, both times that I've watched. Well, I've watched The Haunting of Hill House many times. I've only watched The Haunting of Bly Manor 
once. It's kind of a hard rewatch for me. Weirdly harder for me to rewatch than Haunting of Hill House. And I relate to Haunting of Hill House more, so that's kind of weird. But it's like an emotional thing. Very emotional. But I those are like two of my favorite shows. So yeah, Maddie, I do. And Nova, thanks so much for the super chat. I appreciate you. Okay. Let's give it a watch. Once again, this is called The Kid and the Camera. Star Clock Stories. The Kid and the Camera. Once upon a star, there lived a boy named Caleb. Hi, Caleb. He was a happy little tot of six Aww. years old. And on his birthday, he received a very special gift. His very own photo camera. Kalen loved the camera. Incredible animation. So much dude. that he took it out every day, snapping photos of anything he could. A picture here, a picture there. Oh, a until real one dog. day, a terrible accident happened. Oh no, Caleb, no, your camera. Oh, this is terrible. Rigged. And Absolutely the rigged. Broke. Womp womp. Poor Caleb. Caleb didn't sleep a wink. Haunted by thoughts of his once perfect camera late into the night. Is his name Caleb or Caleb? Because the, the subtitles keep picking it up as Caleb. But I don't know what his name actually is. That time that the narrator said it, it kind of did sound like Caleb. I thought it was Caleb. What is this boy's name? Once upon a star, there lived a boy named Kalen. Is it Kalen? I don't know. I don't know if it's Caleb or Kalen. Either way, this poor kid, he's sad about his camera. He's real sad. Uh, Kayla P, <laughs> speaking of <laughs> Kaylin, Kayla, um, just wanted to say I hope you're having a great day. Your videos bring me so much joy. Thank you for what you do. Thank you so much for being here, darling angel. I love you very, very much. Oh, sorry, sweetie. Caleb, I think. Yeah, a lot of people say Caleb. I think Caleb. I think it's Caleb. Sleep a wink. Haunted by thoughts of his once perfect camera late into the night. That was when a sudden sound caught his attention. Don't answer, please. He looks at the camera. We just didn't know where the sound was coming from. It looks like there's something outside of the window. I hate how silent it and got. And there stood on the other side of Kaylin's bedroom window. A large winged creature. Hello there, young lad, greeted the creature. I'm the Kipsneed, your sleep fairy. Sleep fairy? That is correct, replied the Kipsneed. My job is to make sure you get a good night's sleep, but it's come to my attention that you haven't been resting at all lately. I'd like to know the reason why. It's the camera. It's the camera. Also, don't trust, I don't trust the Kipsneed. I don't trust the Kipsneed. I don't trust the kips need. Hi, <laughs> Grayson. Thanks for modding. Uh, why is it outside of his window? A sleep demon, perhaps. Maybe not a sleep fairy. Kaylin had never heard of a sleep fairy. My parents told me not to talk to strangers. Strangers? I'm no stranger. I know all the girls and boys around the globe. I know their parents. No, their you're homes, not Santa. Their names. Why? I even know your name, Kayla. Now, would a stranger know your name? The reason that that's funny is because <laughs> the closed captions make it a different name every single time. It started as Caleb. It turned into Kaylin. This winged creature is calling the little boy Kayla. Like, it's funny because he's sitting there. He's like, 
well, I know your name, Kayla. <laughs> it's like, nobody knows this kid's name. Absolutely no one. Like, he just shows up and he's like, uh, Kay, Kayla. And the kid's like, I think so, yeah. <laughs> Kaylin thought on it for a moment. No, I guess not. If you must know why I'm awake. It's my camera. Oh. It's broken. And just like that, tears welled up in Kaylin's eyes. Let me see. The dog! Then the Kipsneed had an idea. Why don't I get this camera fixed for you? Perhaps that would help you sleep easier. You could do that? Of course, and I know just the place. A factory in my home world. I'll lead you to the portal. In just follow my voice. His home and the world? Kipsneed disappeared into the night. Yeah, can we talk about this kid? I think the kid's name is Kaylin. I think the kid's name is actually Kaylin. Somebody told me that in the description box. It's Kaylin. It is Kaylin. I it just said Caleb the first time in the um the subtitles and I got confused from there. But like that makes sense. It sounded like Kaylin every single time after, so that makes sense. Um I'm pausing the the self-care timer because it only has 5 minutes left and I don't want it to ring in the middle of our horror movie with this first one, so we'll take a break after this one ends. Why would the Kipsneed need to take this little kid to a portal? Kira Black said, that's the fae. Don't accept the gift. That's so true. I didn't think about it from that angle. If it is a fairy, you don't accept gifts from fairies. Because then you're in debt to them. At least I think that's how it works. I actually don't know. I don't know anything. Um. Okay. Sorry, one sec. This way. This is a beautiful short Kaylin film. followed close behind the Kipsnip. I can't get over the animation. It's gorgeous. Snapping photos to mark the way in case of getting lost. Okay. Sometimes the photos are not animated oh, though. Yeah. Like, sometimes he takes a photo and it's like a real dog, a real tree. I think that's interesting. At last, Kaylin reached a house. It's really quiet. Oh, I'm not loving that. Seems quite abandoned, thought the boy. And dark, but there was the Kip's Needs voice again, beckoning. The portal to my home world's inside, come along. I'm like, actually really... I must have my camera fixed. Oh no, I'm like freaked out by this. So, in spite of his obvious oh, fright... No. Kaylin no, marched into the home. I didn't love that either. Did this camera get fixed? Oh, these are the photos from the broken camera. Is that a, it's a log? So he's taking photos, I think, as he goes. He just opened up a log. What is that? What is what is that? Is that the Kip's need? That looks like a puppet or something. Also, none of these photos are animated. I have chills. Um, he's going down into a basement. There's something down there. You can see the face. No, Kaylin. Oh my God, I have chills.
that was not the Kip stain. Some weeks later, authorities discovered the basement. The rest of the boy was never found. Oh my God, full body chills, full body chills. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh, that was such an awful ending. Oh my God, that was so scary. Caitlin, no, that was so good. Oh my God, I knew it was good too. I had seen like basically up until the part where he follows the Kip Sneed, which um, I also feel like maybe somebody said, um, maybe it was actually Ryan said something like that Kip Sneed sounds like kidnapped. You know what I mean? Like kind of. Also self-care check here. <laughs> Tee -hee, the timer is going to go off now. Self-care time. <laughs> Great timing. That was so good. Again, that's from Grumbled Entertainment. Um, oh my god, I loved the mix between the like the the animation plus the real world aspects. I need to add this link to the description box really fast. I just realized because I wasn't expecting to react to it. Um What was it called again? The the kid in the camera. The kid in the camera. That was creepy. Wait, why is everyone saying Mikey? Is Mikey here? Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? I don't see her comment. Everyone's saying Mikey's name and I can't find her. I'm going to start shaking. Where is she? Oh, Mikey. <laughs> Mikey Melendez. Melendez, I'm so sorry. You have the same name as one of my best friends. I was so confused. Um. Okay, wait. I need to put this in. What was it called again? It was the kid in the camera. The kid in the camera. Okay, there we go. Okay, let me pop the music back on for you guys. We're gonna take a little breaky break. Um, I think I might need a snack. I just feel like I'm hungry. I guess we've been live for a while. It's almost been an hour and a half. Um, uh, Sinner, it's my birthday in two days and this is my first time seeing you stream. I love you, Loie. I've been watching you for years and you brought me so much happiness. Thank you for all that you do. I love you so much, Sinner. That feels bad to call you that, but happy early birthday. Happy, happy, happy early birthday. No, Mikey M Melendez, you are never a disappointment. I love you so very much. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry if that happened. I'm so happy you're here. I love you very, very much. Thank you for being here. Um, But happy early birthday. Thanks for being here. Happy first ever scream stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Kailanta said, Loey, my heart and soul. I thought today might not be a streaming day. I'm happy to see you. Happy to see you too, friend. I'm glad I got to make it. And Ash said, what the hell? I'm shook. <laughs> That's so real. That's so real. That's so real. It was really good though, right? It was really, really, really a good short film. Lex, welcome to the channel memberships as well. Okay, quick um, healthcare, healthcare, quick mental care, uh, mental, mental wellness break. We're going to take a little breaky break. If you have not already, now is not the choice. You don't have a choice. It's time to hydrate. 
Get your water, get your beverage, have a little sippy sip. I, um, I can't decide if I want to turn on the kitchen light, whether or not I want it to stay dark and spooky back there or if I want it to be like illuminated. I kind of feel like today is a dark and spooky night. I might leave them off. Um, hydrate, please. If you're hungry, let's get a snack. I'm going to see if maybe I have a snack to get. Um, and then if you haven't had your meds yet today, please go ahead and go get your meds. Go to the bathroom. Hot chocolate is okay. Coke, I listen, listen. You have your bevy. Have your bevy. But please also drink a little bit of water. Please, 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 please. Drink something. But I would love if you could have a little sip of water somewhere in there. Dr. Pepper does technically have water in it. It's not what I would want for you, but I... I'm not technically your mother, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna put you guys on a BRB. I'm gonna run to the bathroom and make sure the dogs don't need to go potty as well. And then we will be back for the next couple of movies. Yay, movie night. <laughs> See you guys in a few minutes.
Okay, I'm back, I'm back. Hello, everybody. Hello, I hope you had a good break. I have crackers. I'm gonna see if, oh, sorry. Tony P, welcome to the channel memberships. I'm so happy to have you. Thank you, Lex, for joining them as well. I'm not sure if I said that before break. Thank you guys for joining. I got some Ritz crackers. Go snack. I worry about calling something like a like a mini sleeve of Ritz crackers girl dinner because that is not the point of girl dinner. What did you guys talk about while well, I was gone? Were you plotting? Were you scheming? I'm actually gonna have some liquid IV because I'm so dehydrated. Y'all, I'm having the worst damn period. I'm having the worst period. I don't know if I'm just like, I have been really stressed. There's been a lot going on, but damn, it hurts. These cramps are killing me. So, hydration station it is. I'm gonna give everyone about like two-ish minutes to get back and then we'll get started again. Sorry, Normie. Um, let me put the the rules. Let me pin the rules. Oh my god, Chef Boy R D is like girl dinner if I've ever if I've ever heard girl dinner. <laughs> who do you think you said in the super chat who do you said my partner heard you mention to drink water when he walked in and was like okay fine whoever you are voice <laughs> and left to go get water that's so funny <laughs> i'm making everybody everybody hydrate Brittany keen welcome to your first ever live happy to have you God, I love Ritz. I love Ritz crackers more than most things. Ava Soup, welcome to your first ever live. Happy you're here. Lomi, what do you think about Mexican Coke? Um, I had Mexican Diet Coke when I was in Mexico earlier this year, maybe? But I don't remember noticing that much of a difference, actually. I haven't had like regular Coca-Cola though. It's not an Uncrustable, what you eating? Crackers. I don't have any Uncrustables, sadly. Happy birthday, Kayla! Happy happy birthday! So many birthdays today. Cosmic's birthday. Kayla's birthday. You know, I thought about that recently, how like, when I was growing up, Every time that anybody would have the same birthday as me, I was like, oh my God, that's crazy. What are the odds we have the same birthday? And it's just like a one in 365 day chance. Like it's like a one in 365 chance you'll share a birthday with someone. That's not that much. Like, of course you're going to share birthdays with people. Especially when I do these streams, we have like a thousand people in here at the time or at a time. Drew, hi. Happy you made it, baby. Lurking while playing Elden Ring, he says. Well, enjoy your Elden Ring. All right, let's get back to... Oh, 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 I just realized I'm on the wrong thing. Okay. Which one should we get into next? We'll do Don't Peek next, I think. Hi, Holly. Thank 
thanks for being here, Holly. I love you so much. Amanda said, Loey is a god. Loey is the breeze of my hair on the weekend. Loey is a relaxing god. And aren't they envious? Aren't you envious that for you, Loey is not an, a, a, a nice thought? Like, aren't you envious that Loey is not a relaxing thought? Aren't you envious that for you, it's not? There are people out there who get spooked. <laughs> I'm the boogeyman. I go, woo. <laughs> but for Amanda, I, I represent a relaxing thought. What a joy. What a pleasure. Um. Also, to update you guys, I'm blocking off this part of my house. Like, I'm going to have, like, a curtain here um, so you guys don't get so freaked out about the windows because I tried to hang curtains above that area i can't get them to stay i've tried command strips i've tried all sorts of shit i don't know why i can't get curtains to stay right there so i'm planning on closing off this part of my room i just haven't gotten the stuff in the mail yet all righty shall we get back to it um and then <coughs> excuse me okay this next um this next movie is called don't peek it's a horror short by julian territory territory i started like reading the description am i okay it's by julian terry <laughs> jesus it was also apparently made with three people and a pocket camera during quarantine. That's amazing. So this has like almost 10 million views. Almost 10 million views. That's like slay. Actually slay. I cannot wait to watch this one. Oh, no closed captions, unfortunately. Sorry, y'all. Um, Kailanta said, I said it once, I'll say it again. Loey chat and these streams are literally self-care. So true. So true. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you, Jenny. Um, yeah, I'm setting the self-care timer again. Thank you guys. Self-care timer. An hour. We got to take another break. Um, me when I peek. <laughs> Roby. Why is that so funny? Me when I peek. <laughs> Don't peek. Me when I peek. Okay. Oh, I'm very glad your birthday was good, Kayla. Happy, happy birthday. I'm glad you got to hang out here. It sounds like you had a great day. Good, good day. I'm glad you're ending off your, your birthday with us. Thank you very much for hanging out. All right, let's see how it goes. I'm trying to make sure I can see you guys when I... That's what I was worried about was the fact that not all the super chats are coming in through Streamlabs. This happens every single time. Chelsea, morning. I don't know if you you retracted your thingy. I'm very sorry, but thank you very much for the super chat. I, I don't know what it means when it says message, message retracted, but thank you so much. Um, Confused Fish Productions said, much love, Loie. Keep being you. Much love to you, Confused Fish. I hope you, you stay swimming out there. And then Danny said, hey, Lo, tomorrow's my Graham's birthday. Can you say hi to Sheila? She's turning 71 and she thinks you're very pretty. Oh, my God, the big 7-1. Can she drink alcohol now? Queen Sheila, happy, happy birthday, Sheila. Happy birthday. That's so exciting. <laughs> I think she's very pretty. <laughs> okay. All right, let me. really hope I didn't miss anything else. Have I ever watched Crypt TV? I have. I played um I played a like a text message game once that was like written by them or based on one of their stories and then they wrote it. Let's see how the uh audio is. Let me get in. It's a little loud for me. All right. Don't peek. Guys, you can't peek. Don't peek. No peeking. None. Oh 
my god, she's on her switch. She's just like me. She's playing Animal Crossing. She's just like me. Nothing bad could possibly happen. Oh, it was just incense. I thought I, I saw smoke, but I didn't know. Was it her? Wait, it was her dresser opening? When she, ooh, that's creepy. When she went to change an Animal Crossing, her, de her, her dresser opened. I keep wanting to call it a desk. Do it again, do it again, do it again, do it again. See what happens. Terrible idea, never listen to me. That's so spooky. That's such a good concept. So whatever she interacts with in Animal Crossing, it'll do in her room. Now she's going to a desk. <gasps> She's way too chill about this. Don't turn off all the lights, babe. Please, please, please. Okay. We're turning off all the lights. We're turning off all the lights. That's fine. Did she see something in her house in Animal Crossing? What is that? God, I have chills. That is so good. Girl, you would surely die first in the horror movie, and unfortunately, you are in one. It's still giggling. It's still giggling to the switch. said, will you let me out? No. Say no. No. No, Zozo. No. No, no. to the floor and crawl under there. Thar? I can't even talk. I'm so freaked out. Don't peek. I'm shy. Don't peek. Don't peek. I think she said yes. I think she accidentally said yes to letting Zozo out. 
This is so unfortunate. This is so unfortunate. Animal Crossing horror movie. I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm so on edge from this one. Did you pee? <gasps> oh, everything's back to normal. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Everything's just back to normal and everything is fine. Oh my God. <laughs> Pretty gnarly looking. That was so good. Not the switch. Not the switch. That was so good. Wow, that was a phenomenal horror concept, especially around the time of quarantine too. We were all so into Animal Crossing because like it was the way to like live outside of our homes. You know what I mean? Like it was our way to like live outside of our own like self contained bubble. And that's just so creepy. This was released in October of 2020. Oh my god, that was so good! What the heck? Once again, that was by Julian Terry. I have everything linked down below for you guys to, to go and give all these uh, films some love. But oh my god, that was incredible. That was incredible. Maggie May said, why are you the sweetest? Like, seriously, that's so sweet of you, Maggie. Thank you so much. I love you. Cass, thank you so much for joining the VIP loves. I love you. Nikki C said, how you been, Loey? I'm okay. Not doing so bad. Surviving the hurricane, the tropical storm, earthquake hybrid. Chelsea said, let's try this again. That was like lights out. Hey again, Chelsea. Um, it was kind of like lights out, huh? That's sort of what it reminded me of too. Like lights out meets like Animal Crossing, like video game horror. It felt a little bit like those, um, remember back in the day when everybody would write those scary haunted game cartridge, um, like creepypastas? That's sort of what it reminded me of a little bit. Like a little bit. Hades is having a dream. Do you guys hear him? Are you having a good dream, sir? Are you having a nice dream? I don't want to wake him up. I'm going to scare him if I do. But he's having a little puppy dream. He's having a little puppy dream. That's crazy. <laughs> Senku said hi Lily. I lip eye emojis. Love you so much. Thanks for being here. Okay, so now we're gonna watch this one called Disguise. Not gonna lie to you, no concept of what this, this is about, but it's by Tyler Zajous. Oh my gosh. I am not, you know what? It's written by Tyler. It's written by Tyler C. And I'm really excited to watch it. This one has 2.2 million views from two months ago, which is pretty impressive um, in, in views. So I have to assume it's a good one. It's also 10 minutes long, so it's longer than any of the other ones that we've played so far. So careful not to peek. I'm going to play this for a second, see where the volume's at for y'all. I think that's okay. Gosh, sorry. Cass said, random question, I'm about to foster two male cats and already have one female. Any advice on how to introduce them to each other? Um, assuming everybody's neutered um, and spayed and stuff, I haven't noticed too much of a difference in introducing different genders of cats to each other, really. Um, 
but when I've introduced my cats in the past, I've done, I've, I've like kept one cat in a room to themselves where they could be totally fine. They could sniff each other through the doors, whatever. And then I'm not really even sure. I'm not even sure how you would introduce them to each other. When I introduced all my cats together um, two years ago, because my three foster fails had never met Lily, Gigi, or Carson before. So it was a pretty big transition. And when they met, we just, we did it nice and slow. We let everybody sniff each other on the sides of the doors. I had, like, sometimes I would put, like, I had, um one cat in a crate where the other cats could sniff and everybody got treats and stuff like that and honestly it wasn't bad all my cats get along pretty well now Gigi doesn't like anybody but that's just she's never liked anybody so and the only pets of mine that don't get along are Gigi not Gigi sorry are um Hades and Moo Moo Hades does not actually that's a lie Hades loves every single cat in this house Mumo doesn't like Hades because he's very big and very loud and very scary. Actually, I have a very big scar on my hand. And this is from when I was holding Mumu and Hades like got right up under her to give her a little kiss. And she lost her freaking mind, dude. It was nutty. <laughs> it was nutty. But I would recommend looking up more information. I'm not sure that I'm even like, I, I even know how you'd be able to introduce them um and i don't even know if i did it right but <laughs> amanda sugar also said listen if you've never heard of it there's this pet scop like arc called catastrophe crow catastrophe crow is um it's a faux nintendo 64 game right i feel like i've heard about that i've never like looked into it but yeah i'll have to watch that sometime and then maggie may thank you so much for joining the vip loves uh tier i appreciate you very much enjoy those extra videos and all that fun stuff um, I hope I'm saying this correctly, but, oh goodness, Chewan lover, um, get them used to each other's scents, pet one with a blanket or towel, and then pet the other with the same fabric and vice versa, my cats got used to each other pretty quickly with that method, that's so genius, that's so smart, that's so, 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 so smart, actually, that's the best advice I've ever heard, okay, I'm playing. Jinxie said, uh, this is my last shot of the night as I must go to bed, but lovely Lodi, Loi, if you ever want some short horror films, check out Alter on YouTube. I think our next one is from Alter. We're watching Kaylee's last review. So, <laughs> but I do, I've seen other Alter horror movies or horror shorts, but thank you for the rec, Jinxie. Good night. Have a good rest of your night. All right, let's go. Disguise, baby. useless useless what is the man for if he won't even wake up and defend the house this is shot really cool like the the actual like Cinematography is just really cool and uh, different. Thanks for joining the VIP loves, Amanda. I love you. Big bang. That would look like something is in the attic. and very smart women want to die first in a horror movie. What is happening? Uh, man. They always 
investigate, dude. Always. Oh man. Sp no, no. Hate that. Hate that. Hate that. Hate that. Hate that. Hate that, hate that. Actually, can we go back downstairs now? Maybe, perhaps? The Halloween decor is creeping me out. girl I don't love the scarecrow I really don't love the scarecrow was a face in the scarecrow, right? Oh my god, no! Oh, no, 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 no. No. The husband isn't even awake! Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Sorry, 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 I screamed so loud. I'm so sorry. Scarecrow go. Where did the scarecrow go? <gasps> He's downstairs. He's getting your man, girl. He is getting your man. Why is it dark down there now? Or was it dark? <gasps> oh my god. 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 Is he gonna close her up there? <laughs> Every time she looks away, he like, he like, he like, I'm so sorry, Hades. He like teleports. I really, I. Okay. Okay. What are we okay okaying? Because I don't think anything about the situation is okay okay. I have a Hades hair in my mouth. Okay. Are we good, chat? <laughs> freaked out. I was going to take a second to read the chats, but I think I want to keep going because it's so tense right now and I don't want to like break in the middle of it. Also, we only have like five more minutes, so not even like four. teddy bear or something like I need I need Annie actually I need Annie I need Annie's fat little body in my arms so I can just hold on to her <laughs> for comfort right now He's gonna attack. He's gonna get up and attack. He's gonna get up and attack. Don't go near him. There's another one, isn't there? 
oh my god, wait, that wasn't what was coming after her. There's a scarecrow, and then something was disguised as a scarecrow. Taking it back. I was not expecting that. That was so cool. Whatever that thing was, it was like pretending to be her. God, that's really interesting. Like really interesting. baby chicken i wonder if that's like the director's um or the 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 filmmaker's signature is oh it is it's a signature it's his signature apparently disguise was actually based on a reddit no sleep story as well which is really really cool which was written i think by the same guy how cool was that? That was really, really, really enjoyable and so well done. It was just like beautifully shot. Wow, it was based on the short story, The Ultimate Disguise. I liked it. Why is the husband sleeping so late though? <laughs> Why does that man sleep so late? Also, Amanda, thanks for joining the VIP loves. Nadia Wiley, thanks for joining the channel memberships. So welcome, welcome, happy to have you here. Amanda said, hell no, please, I beg. I assume around the time of the scarecrow. Um, and then Kira said, well, Jason is in for a surprise. Should have woke up. So real. So, so real. That was so good, though. That was so freaking good. I really enjoyed that. Okay, now we're going to watch... Um, well, actually, before we do, I think, like... I think it's interesting because the entire movie, we're, we're spending the whole time, like, terrified of the scarecrow. We're, like, scared that the scarecrow is somebody. The scarecrow is an intruder. The scarecrow has been, like, you know, someone is inside of the scarecrow. But it's so crazy because, like we don't that that's the protagonist the whole time and we just don't realize it until the end anyways i really enjoyed that i thought it was so well done i'll have to read that story sometimes sorry my nose is so itchy 
Um, so the last one we're watching before we um, swap over into our um, horror games for the night is called Kaylee's Last Review. This is posted on Alter. I think um, the actual director is Julia Bailey, um, or the, the creator. And yeah, I've, I've watched this one before, part of it anyways. It's really good. I stopped watching it entirely because I was like, oh, I want to watch this on stream one day. Rogue Love, thank you so much for joining the channel memberships. Which one was it at the end? Kayla asked, was it her, the real one, or the her pretending to be her? I thought it was the real one. I think it's the real one that was her at the end. I thought I thought it was her at the end anyway. Um, okay. Kaylee's last review. This one's so good. Hey guys, it's me, Callie with the K and a Y. Your Callie, Callie's driver. last review. Okay. Callie's last review, let's go. This is taking me back to my beauty guru days, baby. 2012 Loey Lane is thriving. Hey guys, it's me, Callie with the K and a Y, your favorite beauty blogger. Oh my God, go off, girl. Oh, me? me? Yes, you. I'm just kidding. Your favorites might have more experience or subscribers or sponsorships. No, it's or sponsorships. you. Maybe it's even you. a real ship. I don't know. I don't have a ship. I can't compete with that. All I can do is try to give you real, truthful, and honest reviews of products that I think are going to change your life. God, Today's video so is my first ever sponsored review of this exclusive new at-home chemical peel kit from Sue Skincare Essentials. That's right. I'm going to be giving myself a chemical peel at home. Oh boy. So they reached out to me. They're this cool new startup. Oh, babe. They asked if I would do a tutorial and review of this product. A big red flag right there. If a chemical peel is coming to your doorstep from a startup, from a, from a new company, a startup, let's not, let's not actually do that, baby. Let's not take that. I think that would be, that would be ideal, maybe. Um, also, Kylanto said reactions and games, low you spoil list. <laughs> it's a mega stream tonight, babe. Which I was super excited about because I don't have that many subscribers yet which I'm working on. I'm kind of like one of the first people who's able to even try this product. I think I got kind of like a little, little misprint, just no big deal, but like, like her face is a little bit like, you know. Oh my God, I completely forgot to say, I don't have Maybe any foundation on, it's a mess. So if we just take a little look, see here, hyperpigmentation and rosacea on my cheeks, fine lines on my eye area whenever I make an expression. My forehead is another story. I mean, take a look at this. It would be it's so sorry it's just so crazy because like this is just how critical we are of our face as women and especially when you're a woman on the internet like like not me in my last stream literally talking about like getting my lips done and now I have like this weird like this sense of like I will go into my I get Botox um and I've always been really like transparent about doing like Botox, but I, I've always gotten Botox for my, um, headaches. I will raise my brows when I get really stressed. And if I don't have this area fully, like, like frozen, I will just like give myself the craziest headaches, but I cannot sit here and lie to you and say that I'm not a 30 year old woman who also likes the look of Botox because it smooths out my lines. But like, it's, this is just a normal, beautiful woman, a beautiful, normal woman who, yeah, is saying, like, look at this. Look at how my forehead creases. When I move my eyebrows like a normal human being. Unreal. And we are just, I, I don't know. I think that this will probably, I'll have a lot of commentary around this one. But, um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Also, Summer, um, thank you so much for the gifted membership. I appreciate you very, very much. I love you. It would be amazing if this peel could just get rid of everything. I can't wait to start sharing this with you. Is this going to be you, like a genie in the bottle where it's like one of those um, be careful what you wish for type of stories? I feel like yes. I feel like yes. yes. Oh my god, the editing! This hey is guys, everything. 
guys, to it is application day. I am super excited to get going with this. Again, sorry, no foundation. But obviously can't put a peel on over foundation, so I need to be au naturel. <laughs> There's no instructions on the product, but I've been emailing Red flag. It to myself. With Red flag. Sweet rep. They've given me everything I need to know. Let's get going. Step number one, make sure that you have gloves on. You don't want your hands to peel. Unless you have acne on your hands, in which case, like, I can't help you. And then we are going to take our product. Ooh, very powerful chemicals in there. That can not be a good sign. Formula for you yet. I just know it's powerful. Callie, that can't be a good and sign. Because that's what you want, because that looks what will work. Then we're going to take this cute little fan brush, dip that in here. Be careful there's not like excess drips. That was a little bit of an excess drip. I should go ahead and give you all a gore warning now. If you're not good okay. with gore Ooh, and, and, and faux blood and stuff like that, this, this is pretty heavy on it. Pretty much from now on, you're going to see gore in increasing amounts. This is our last movie of the night that we're going to be watching. But just so you know, it's going to get a little, it's going to get a little red. It's going to get a little gross. Sweet. Okay, so it's only been about um, a minute and a half. Oh, I feel like my no. face is getting really tight. And I see there's actually quite a bit of redness. So I think we're, I'm, I think I'm going to, I'm going to neutralize now. So that oh. is what... Um, be neutralizing. Wait, is her name Kaylee or Callie? I need to hear her say it again. Hey guys, it's me, Callie with the K. Callie, Callie with a K and a Y. Got it, got it, got it. All right, Callie with a K and a Y is having a bad day. Okay, so it's only been about um, a minute and a half. I feel like my face is getting really tight, and I see there's actually quite a bit of redness. Callie, so I think, we're, I'm, I think yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna neutralize now. So that is what. Um, the neutralizing cream is for. Should have done this a little bit earlier, actually. Oh, no. Oop. Rub that all over where you applied the peel. Gosh, that is a tricky little bottle here. I'm gonna actually I'm just going to use it like this. It feels so nice. Like she's like in so bottle. much pain. <laughs> when you pat the sides of ketchup. Good night, Summer. Love you. Ketchup bottle is like a little... Baby butt comes out. And thank you so much, Summer. Sorry, let me rewind that for a sec. I'm going to press play and let this play all the way. But thank you so much, Summer. Good night, good night. I know a lot of you might be... <laughs> Kira Black said it's from Wish, I'm telling you. Not the Wish brand chemical peel. Talk about a red freaking flag. Ashlyn Ozella, also thank you so much for one month. Happy you got to catch the stream. Bye, Summer. Good night, good night, good night. Okay. I will read the rest of the super chats and stuff that come in um after this one ends so we can get through it. But... Yeah, she very clearly is in a lot of pain. When you pat the sides of ketchup bottles, like a little baby butt comes out a little better, but that's almost not even happening here. I'm gonna go put some more of this on and then I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so quick change of plans. I'm actually coconut oil because the rep said that that is pretty similar in um, like formula to what the neutralizing agent is. I actually ran out of <laughs> the neutralizing agent. I don't know if that's just because maybe I'm like, maybe just like a baby. <laughs> yeah, I, I kind of need some more of that because this is just sort of itchy and oh starting to feel Oh my God, Callie, intense. no. But I think that's kind of normal. So I'm going to go grab some of that and I will let you guys know how things are later. Okay, bye. Um, One other thing. Oh, I got my coconut oil. One other thing I did want to say is you are not supposed to go out in the sun with this. <laughs> I I'm in the sun right now, but I think it should be fine because it's just a short little walk back to my apartment. It's like a 10 minute walk. I'm walking fast. <laughs> I think 10 it should be fine. minutes. I'm neutralizing more, some extra neutralization. I think it should be okay. So, but I just wanted to tell you because I'm always trying to be honest with these things. Kelly, right, 10 minutes in the sun. Progress. Hey guys. So, it's actually only about like this kind of hours later. There's obviously been some like really incredible progress. So, what's happening right now is a lot of that bad stuff is starting to come to the surface that like like crustify a really really crazy thing is that there's actually stuff that was like hiding underneath my skin oh my god my bangs look crazy i'm sorry <laughs> this section over here <laughs> on, like honestly i think that's just like pores i didn't even know were clogged yikes the main thing is just like keeping it clean and like making sure you're not picking at stuff oh oops that's um should have should have cleaned that up before i just have like a little bag of things i'm keeping in here i will check in with you guys later 
Holly. Hey guys. Uh, I definitely don't want to sugarcoat things. Things are definitely feeling a little tender today. You were scammed, my love. You were scammed. You were scammed. You were scammed. You were scammed. Not the chemical burns. Oh my God. Literally this entire time too, I thought like, obviously the chemical peel was botched. She was sent like this botched chemical peel because somebody wanted to see this beauty influencer suffer. But like, <laughs> then she ran out into the sun with it with like not enough neutralizing stuff. Like now I'm like, is this equal parts user error actually and like a very terrible product? I don't know. No, 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 no. This is not real for anyone just joining in. Major gore warnings, but of course not. This is not real. It's a short film. Everything is like definitely activated. It's for sure crustified, as we said. But um, I know indeed. it's at the point where the new skin is like starting to form underneath. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Sometimes that like loosens things up a little bit. Oh but my I'm, god! I just want to make sure that you're not actually like just sitting there like feeling it, going a little stir crazy. It's kind of a nice weekend. Oh, but, like, no. This is all gonna be worth it. Oh, Callie. Major gore warning, of course. Probably the most disappointing update that I could even have imagined. Okay. Sue Skincare no longer wants to do this sponsorship. This me. is the most disappointing they, part? You know, basically want to call the whole thing off. Their email addresses are no longer um, functional. Now, I can't get in touch with them. I feel like they, they quit on me, you know? They're trying to blame me, but maybe I have like kind of sensitive skin. I think that I just have a more intense healing process than than we were expecting. It's just like, it's ju it just hits a little too close to home, y'all. Not that I ever went through anything like this, but as, as a former beauty guru herself, like, I, it ju it's just too close to home. It's too close to home. It's too close. Callie, babe, I just, I am, it's sleeping. Your face is falling pretty rude off. Of Sue's skincare to give up. I know. It's pretty rude of Sue's skincare to give you stage one billion chemical burns. Never give up. I stay positive, even when when things seem tough. I I move forward and I keep doing it. Abandoning the project is the worst thing that you can do. It, surely, yeah, you're so right. Sue's Just... skincare made a mistake. I think they made a big mistake. I do this for you, for my followers. You guys are my everything. I'm going to finish this video without them and finish this peel. They're going to regret not choosing me to be the sponsored face of Sue Skincare's Brilliant Reveal Chemical Peel. exactly as advertised incredible it just peeled off every Callie's channel had a total subscriber count of eight I have chills no email correspondence with anyone from Sue's skincare was found on Callie's computer no one has ever been able to find a website contact or any other verification that the company exists the only recent emails in Kelly's inbox were online order confirmations for DIY product packaging materials and 100%
that one. Oh my God, I loved that one. That was so good. Yeah, the plot twist was crazy. That was crazy, that plot twist. Wow, holy cow. Like the whole time. She just faked the whole thing. And now she's just, that's nuts. Wow, when she said at the beginning too, like, I hope this gets rid of everything. Like, it literally, it took off all of her skin. That was insane. And oh my God, we should get a sequel called Callie's Apology Video. So true, but only if there's a uke. <laughs> like only only if it's a musical apology that was incredible wow I really enjoyed all of those honestly I really enjoyed all of those those were really 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 good what a fun little horror movie marathon slay <laughs> what was you guys's favorite tonight honestly I don't I'm trying to think of which one I liked the best um, maybe the Animal Crossing one. That one was so, so, so unique. But the one that we watched, um, Disguise, I think it was, like, that one was incredible, too. Like, it was just shot so beautifully. Oh, mwah, chef's kiss. Shadowflower16, thanks for making it tonight. Loe, I've missed the last few streams, so I'm happy to finally catch one. Looks like it's about to get crazy. Love and light always. Love you so much, Shadowflower. Thanks for making it in tonight. They were all so good. We really lucked out. Lots of really, really, really good videos tonight. Kylandis also said dot, 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 just put some sunscreen on it. I know when she was talking about going into the sun without sunscreen, I was like, what are, what? what? <laughs> like, what are you talking about? Going into the sun without sunscreen. Like, oh my God. The Animal Crossing one was so good. I remember nothing before the last one. Honestly, we went through a lot. We watched four movies tonight, which is kind of impressive of us. Uh -huh. Let's see. I have a special guest for the night to play some Phasma with. Bye, Crow. Good night, good night. And good night to anyone heading out. Let me put on some music while I figure out what we're doing next. Um... Good night to anyone heading out. Have a good rest of your day. Good night, good night, good night. Love you guys so much. Crispy Kristen said, lovey, lovey. <laughs> I used to hate Sundays because of football. Now I look forward to them. Sundays are Sundays are days for the girls. For the girls. And Maggie said, as a CNA, I have to laugh in the bandages. <laughs> it was so good though. It was honestly so good. It was so freaking good. Thanks for the super chat as well, Angel. Oh, I still need to update Faz actually. Little fruit bat, thank you for being so entertaining and genuine over the years. I've been watching since 2018 and have no intention of stopping. Keep slaying Lowy. Thank you very much, little fruit bat. Love you, love ya. Thanks for being here for that long. Oh man. We got about 14-ish minutes. Sorry, Hades. I just kicked off my um slippers too close to him. The whole stream, FYI, the entire time, Hades has just been under my desk. I was having this conversation with my friends last night because we were talking about, um, we were talking about like dogs 
and just like the dogs that we've had over the years and I was like yeah like I've never had dogs like my current dogs but I haven't really ever had dogs before I had we had two dogs growing up thank you so much we had two puppy weppies growing up named Lady and Sonic I was just petting you with my foot don't be mad um we had two dogs but they were like I was, we were in Georgia, they were fully outdoor dogs, like, I don't know. My dogs now are like my kids. But we were talking about dogs and they were, my friends were like talking about theirs and the ones growing up that were like, you know, a little, a little, um, a little, um, independent. I was like, I, what is that? What is that actually? Because Hades is down here with his paw on my leg just staring at me. Actually, never mind. His eyes are closing. He is going back to sleep. He just has to have a hand on me. Like, he's just right under. Thank you, baby. When is the girl dinner stream? One day we'll have a girl dinner mukbang stream, I swear. We'll have one one day, I swear it. But yeah, fun scream stream. We're gonna play a little bit of Phasmophobia before we, we head out. We have a special, uh, a friend I'm gonna play with. It'll be fun. I won't be <laughs> going after the ghosts alone. I also have learned a bit more about the new Phasmophobia update. So I think I'll be a little bit better than I was previously. my game updated okay I think I'll probably open up the game and maybe we will screw around in solo <laughs> until we have company goth auntie the goth auntie thank you so much for your super chat Also, you guys in chat acting like you know who's going to come play. You don't know who's going to come play. You have no idea. <laughs> it's, it's not static, I'll tell you that much. Not tonight. Yeah, Amanda. Yeah, I'm playing with Hec uh, Hecate. Hecate? Hecate. I always say it differently every single freaking time I say it. Yeah, Drew is not the one playing tonight. Let's see. Why would I launch Phasmophobia in VR, Steve? Why would I do that? Not Harley. Hi, Louie. I got a snake yesterday, and her name is Pandora. And we got two new kittens, too. Oh, my God. Har well, not Harley. That sounds like a full freaking house. What are you saying about me? I was saying you're not playing Phasmophobia. <laughs> Unless you are playing Phasmophobia. I don't think you're playing Phasmophobia. <laughs> I told the people you're not playing. You have other things to do. Places to be, people to see. Also, the game is opening up right now. Oh, never mind. Sorry, wrong screen. There we go. Do you guys hear how fast my computer starts going? I literally cleaned it out after the last time I played. Because I was like... Henry's here? Hi, Henry. Henry! Where's Henry? I don't see Henry. Welcome back. I prepared some jobs for you. Oh, there's Henry. Hi, Henry. Yeah, Drew's got Elden Ring to play with the boys. My Evie dear, my Velcro child is sleeping with her butt in my lap. Yeah, Hades literally has a paw pressed to my ankle and he's just out cold right now. The goth auntie, thanks for your super chat. This is my first time in chat. I love you so much. Followed since your episode with Shane and Ryan. Ah, that's crazy. That's a, that's a blast from the friggin' past. 
that's a blast from the past. But honestly, one of my favorite things I've ever done, so. Give me just a sec, guys. I don't want to do this, Steam. I just, I don't want to do this. I don't know how to do this. Thank you, sweetie. I, I need my foot back, though, maybe. Yeah, my foot. There we go. That's nice, huh? Um... Henry's here to make me look bad. Henry would never do that, Sadik. Be quiet. Jolene, just a PSA that I love Faz so much. So true. Faz is so much. So much? What? Faz is so much fun. Ooh, slay. Okay, yay. Figuring it out. I'm figuring it out. Nightmoon, you can go play with me. I play religiously. Thank God. Someone carry me in this damn game, please. I'm begging. Also, Combray said boo. Boo. <laughs> Hi. Thanks for your super chat. Flashback to Loey playing Friday the, the 13th. Honestly, I would play it again, but it, like, tanked my computer. Tanked it. Okay. Let's see. I'm setting stuff up. Looks like there are others out there in need of help. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah! <laughs> I'm so excited for Faz! I love Faz! <laughs> I love Ritz crackers. I'm so happy. We only have five-ish minutes, actually, until our next mental health break. I wonder if we should take it now before we get started. Or if we should get through a game. I think we should probably take it now. We're pretty close. Slide. Yeah. Let's go ahead. Self-care timer only had four minutes left anyway. All right. Sorry, Hades. Go back to sleep. He didn't even wake up. Time to 
hydrate, get a snack, all that jazz really quickly. Let me catch up to the super chats and then I will jump off and let everybody go potty in this house. Um, Mana said, Loey, should we play DVD soon? Literally, please. I would love to play DVD. I love DVD. I love DVD so freaking much. I haven't played it in so long either. <laughs> Maggie said, smoke them with me, Loey. You know, I would honestly love that, actually. That would make me so happy. I, I don't think anything would ever make me happier. Okay, I'm going to put you guys on BRB. Actually, you know what? Yeah, BRB. But you're going to have to listen to the atmospheric music of crickets chirping and phasmophobia. Okay. <laughs> BRB, I'm just gonna let the pups out. Take a second, go get some water, get yourself a snack if you need one. Diamond Love, thanks for joining the channel memberships. Um, run to the bathroom, all that jazz, and when we get back, we will get started. Okay. Wow. All right, so one sec. <laughs>
Oh, hi, Alan. I guess I'm gonna see it. Come here. Hi, Bobby. You wanna kiss? I think I can see. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Your paws are so torn up. Dear God. Hades is awake, in case you can't tell by all the noise in the background. Oh, wow. that's very nice of you. That's very sweet. Whoa! Oh my goodness! I'm pa I'm patting her butt, by the way. I'm not like not patting her. I'm like, you're beautiful. That's what uh, Grayson just said. Grayson said you're a beautiful baby puppy. A beautiful baby puppy. I love you. Look at this dog. Annie, Annie, what are your thoughts on, um, oh, that's Maka. She's in her crate. She isn't feeling very good today. She's been, uh, real cooped up. She's been real cooped up. <sighs> um, not because of the crate, but she just, like, she gets really stressed out if she cannot spend like she just likes to be outside maka just loves being outside and when she can't be outside she just gets so overwhelmed when she can't go potty whenever she wants you know so she was like kind of sticking herself to the back door and i just put her to bed before we we started um amanda please do some of your dvd username please do okay Um, let's see. Got it. And then before we get started, hi. Oh, there we go. Hi, sweet boy. considering you're such a tiny little baby boy. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Hello. Those are crackers. You can't have them. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Oh, good morning. How are you doing, sir? How is your CPC? Is good? Okay. Okay, well that's nice. What's up? I don't have anything for you. I got nothing. Look at all this hair all over me. <laughs> I lip rolled this um this little this little uh oh my god I can't talk sweatshirt before we got started. There is nothing little about this head, Kitsumi. This is a massive, this is a bowling ball of a noggin. And it has to be, you've got so many brains. you got so many brains. He's got brains in there. Ah, it's a, it's a brain monster, he's. It's gonna take all your brains. Hello? Maybe. <laughs> oh, thank you. Do I even have my voice stuff on? I have no idea. Hello? <laughs> Are you there? Oh, 
Hold on. <laughs> We're good. I think we're both here. I think we're good. Um, Twitter is good, Amanda. Thank you, baby. Okay. Let's see, what should we pick? What shall we do? Maybe Bunny Rabbits are calming my nerves before a big surgery tomorrow. Good luck tomorrow, Bunny Rabbit. Good luck, good luck. I know you guys can't um can hear them. I know. I I, I think you might in a minute. Um What baby? I don't have anything in yours, sweetie. I don't have your ball. You didn't give it to me. Oh, you did give it to me. It's just all the way down my chair. That's right. It's incredible how your actions have consequences, don't you think? I guess I, oh my God. I'm gonna turn my game, I guess I'm push to talk. Probably less annoying than hearing <laughs> me stream of consciousness. Here we go. Okay. should we do you know did did static and i finish a single level last time no no we did not um so we could go back to exactly where static and i continuously failed i do feel as though that place does not have the best energy in the entire world if we're being totally honest so maybe we don't go there we could go to the farmhouse this one the grafton farmhouse i don't want to go to a campsite um Let's see. Chloe, can you hear me now? Yes, hello! Hello, hooray! <laughs> I figured it out. <laughs> oh my god, Slay. Okay, perfect, perfect. One second. Let me balance out now. Slay! I'm so happy. Yay! Yay! Okay, I'm gonna turn. Can you say something again? Nervish. I don't know if she heard me. Um, and then I guess I'll do uh, here. Okay, I have myself I have myself back on voice activation, so it's just sheer stream of consciousness. But if that gets annoying, please tell me, and I will turn it off. That's perfectly fine by Slay. me. Static said I was hoping y'all were in a VC so I could just join it and start screaming. Oh, we are gonna, I think we probably are gonna sit on um, Discord, but that's exactly why it won't be a uh, <laughs> server. I'm gonna call you on Discord as well, just so we have that as a backup. Okay. Slay, 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 slay. And then if we both, yeah, that's perfect. We just mute here. Okay, have you, um, when was the last time you played? I have never played. What? <laughs> this is my first time. Oh yeah. my God, wait, that's actually kind of incredible. Okay, slay, <laughs> so I can carry you because I've learned so much about 
um, about uh, the update, I guess, since I played last. Also, Static said, and I quote, that you're so smart that you will carry. So <laughs> hopefully <laughs> you and I, I have faith. I have faith that we're going to do this. I truly do. I have faith that we will get through one. I say we go into a farmhouse. It's a two-story farmhouse. Wait, actually, it's a three story is it a two-story? Yeah, it's a two-story farmhouse. It has 13 rooms. I say we go to a new place because the places that Static and I investigated last time, the quote-unquote easiest ones, they just got, like, bad juju now. You know what I mean? Like, bad vibes. Unless you want to go to the easiest levels. In that case, we can. But I think that these will be fairly comparable. It's 13 rooms and two steps. We could also go to Willow Street, which is 10 rooms and two, two floors. Oh, you know what? I'm, like, saying all of this to you and you've never played this game. Sorry. I, what am I talking about? Okay, so click on the, click on the board. And then when you do that, press the left arrow. And then you'll come over to all of the other maps. You literally told me. You were like, I've never played this. And I was like, okay, so let me just start telling you things. Um, but, yeah, these are, like, the different houses you can go in. It's, like, you can go through three bulletin boards in this area. Um... I only have the Tanglewood Drive unlocked. Oh, really? Room. Okay, well, let's yeah. do that. Perfect. Okay, slay. <laughs> so back to the place that was so haunted. <laughs> okay. Um, so let me make sure we've got some stuff. Since you're new, I'm going to assume you don't have much. Let me do... Yeah. <laughs> Extras of what I can. And then. Do we have. We have two flashlights. We have two thermometers. Thank you, Hades. He's licking my foot. We have two spirit boxes and two EMF readers. Okay, I think we should be good. Don't worry. We'll, we'll definitely make it. We'll absolutely make it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. And if it's not fine, <laughs> it'll still be fine. Um, okay, so if you press ready up, we should be able to go in. I believe in us. Let's go. <laughs> All right, baby. Tanglewood Drive. I thought I had seen the last of this land. <laughs> I swear to you, I thought I had seen the last of this place. Oh, my God, you're so tall. Oh, <laughs> your character was so tall. <laughs> Your character was so tall, but you were just, you were in the air, like, bicycling. <laughs> just, like, moving your little legs. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, my goodness, hello, Bubba's. The dog, don't say we're dead. We're not dead. We're not dead. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. Um, there we go. The audio levels in this game are so tough. Okay, so the ghost is Sarah Hall. So, okay. If you look behind you, that's where you can see the case and, like, what we're investigating. It's um, Sarah Hall. She responds to people who are alone. And then these are, like, the things that we do to, like, get more money, basically, to, like, complete the job. So it's find evidence with the EMF reader, have a member of the team escape during a hunt. We'll see about that. And then we have to get our average sanity below 25%. Let me give you, let me give you a tour of the ghost hunt bus. So... Um, I would not say that it's great. I actually don't know where we sit when the bus is, when, when this big ass thing is moving. But this is where, um, you can see the case. Over here is like a map slash layout of the house. So you can see, I've never used that once, but this is our sanity. I'm, why am I going insane? Oh, wait, we were, wh why am I going insane? I'm not doing anything. Why is my thing? What? <laughs> Why am I going crazy? Um, when we come back to the to the um, to the van, this is where we can see like the activity levels. So it goes from zero, which is nothing, up to a ten, and it'll help us see if the ghost is maybe like more active and hunting and stuff. This is gonna be our supplies on this one. Um, you press E to take things. Pretty standard. Is it? I, I don't know anything. Yeah. So, um, I brought us two flashlights. Uh, you turn on the flashlight with the right click. 
And then um, I took a ghost. Hi, sweet boy. Hi. I took an EMF reader, a spirit box, and a flashlight. I think you should take one of these thermometers right here. You'll, uh, okay. yeah, that one right there. You'll want to, um, when you're walking through the house, it'll slowly start dropping. And the rooms that get below, like, I want to say, like, below five-ish are typically ghost rooms. But then if it gets below zero, that's freezing, which is like an evidence type we can put in. So yeah, I think the thermometer is good. And then I think the other thing, maybe take, um, God, I don't know. You could take, will you take the video camera actually right there? And then we should be good. Okay, slay. And we'll just figure it out as we go. We'll be fine. Did you play the tutorial or anything? No. Okay, Slay. <laughs> I'm so excited. I feel like the storyline here is like we're like we're like roommates. We're like roommates living together and my partner on this ghost hunting job like couldn't come. It's static. He couldn't come. And so you were like, "Oh, no worries. Like my grandpa knew something about ghosts. I'll come with you." And now you're here and like just canonically know nothing about the experience. <laughs> That's my canon anyways. So now um, we just walk through the house. I'm walking around with an EMF to see if that's gonna do anything for me. Um, you can walk around with a thermometer. If you have the thermometer out, you can turn off and on your flashlight with T. Okay. Okay, I don't see anything in here. Is that thing still on the wall? Yeah. EMF isn't going up at all. It's probably isn't it. Um, if you can, bring the camera in here, put it right here on the corner. This is a static. This is a true static, <laughs> indeed. Put it here, and then, uh, well, make sure it's recording, and then press F to, like, place it, and it should be able to look at these two doors, because I feel like usually... Oh, wait, you said something. Sorry. Oh, when... When we're far apart, press B, and we can talk to each other through the walkie-talkie. Okay. Um, how do I make sure it's recording? I think um, you might be able to, like, right-click. When you open it, it should, like... I, sh I think we're probably fine with that. I think it's probably good. We'll be able to check whenever we go back to the car, but I never had to do it. I think Static did it every time, so... I don't see anything on the EMF. All right, garage... Anything on EMF? No? Nothing? Okay. This house isn't very big. It's always kind of surprising to me when I don't find the ghost room, like, immediately in this place. Wait. Uh, did you just turn the lights off? No, the fuse box just blew. Um, let's see if we can find it. I actually have no idea where it is. It respawns every time. I'm gonna see if it's in the garage. Doesn't look like it. And then we can see if uh -oh. let's see uh, let's see if it's in, in the basement maybe it might be in the basement bestie let's see let's see let's see i hate this i'm really sorry it's just beginning um <laughs> i don't see where's the fuse box oh here it is okay we're good we're good we're good all right so we know it's down here that's probably a good thing to did it did i just turn it on yeah the lights are still off up here. Why are all the lights off? What? That was kind of weird. Did all the lights get shut off? I think all the lights got shut off. I've never seen that happen. Like, I've seen the fuse box blow, but it, like, turned off every single light in the whole house. Also, it was when I came into this room that the fuse box blew. So maybe see if the temp is kind of lower in here. I'll go see the other bedroom because we probably don't have much more time before it starts getting active. Oh, here's a bathroom. What'd you say? I can't hear you. Temp is fine in the nursery. It doesn't drop below five, I assume. 
know which room is the ghost room. Oh, you can't keep... Wait, I blew the fuse. You can't keep too many light switches on at once. That's terrible. What? Wait, Cap, do you want to come play with us? I feel like you're really good at this game. Let's see. Cap could carry. I don't know which room is the ghost room. Oh, it threw the camera. All right, I'm gonna pull out the spirit box and see if it'll talk. Are you there? What's your name? Are you friendly? Are you here? Are you tall? Are you short? Are you subscribed to Lowy Lane? I have no idea where this dang room is. Is anything dropping down in temperature? No. Yeah, the EMF isn't going off at all. I have no idea which room it is. Did you just hear that? like something out here cap said sure <laughs> okay we're gonna have an expert to assist us thank god um i recently learned there could be items in all of these like cabinets i don't think we have much longer until it starts until it starts hunting though i'm very confused oh lights off i was using the spirit box and the lights were off are you there? Can you hear me? What's your name? Are you friendly? What do you want? Alright, let's see. I'm gonna keep checking out the basement. If you if you want Oh my goodness, what, babe? You can't do that. You're scaring me. Um, if you want, you can, um, we could split up and see if there's anything happening from other rooms, but we can also travel together. I think it would. Oh, oh, it said yes. What's your name? Are you here? All right, we can put down, um,. We can put down the the floor, the pentacle. Oh, don't get in it. What the hell yeah. is that? I don't know. When did that get here? Hades, you cannot keep giving me I don't play. know, but I hate, I hate this. I hate it. Okay, Why? so press J, go to the tab that says evidence, and click um, spirit box. We'll, we'll mark spirit box because it's a piece of evidence. We have stop, baby. I'm not playing with you right now. You are the sweetest baby in the whole wide world, but we're not doing this. Um, I don't know. Maybe the ghost is in there. I feel like maybe I'll go get the video camera. We don't have a photo camera. Oh, I just grabbed, I grabbed the video. Okay, um, do you want to use it or you can drop it, whichever works. Just see if you can see anything in the circle. Oh, is there something over there? No, that was just the thing glitching. Is there anything there? There's nothing, nothing in the circle on camera. I've never seen it before. I do kind of want to get in it, but I know that'll just be the end of the game. Cause I don't think you'd be able, like, I don't think you would know how to like, it's a, wait, you need to take a pic of its account and take a pic. We don't have a camera. I don't, I haven't unlocked a camera. Unfortunately, if you light all the candles, we don't even have a lighter. We can't buy it. I'm not high enough level. So I wonder if that's, um, have you, did you use the thermometer down there? Uh, I was. Why but... don't you, has it gone below zero or below five down here? Temperature still says it's 20. Is it dropping? 
you have to stand in one place and like keep your eye on it for a while. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's dropping. I don't know if that's the ghost room then. Let, I'm gonna go outside and check the van really fast. Oh, okay, so it doesn't do anything unless you light the candles. Then we're good. I don't even have any candles. The uh, the ghost is pretty active right now, so if you're still inside, be careful. I'm going to put the spirit box down, I guess, since I don't think we need that right now. Not me leaving the house right when you said that. <laughs> I'll take in the ghost journal. I wasn't seeing shit on EVP, but um, let's see. All right. Maybe it'll write in the journal. Oh, you know what? I should keep the spirit box on me, actually. I just realized. I'm probably going to leave behind the EVP. Let's see. Yeah, Cap. Freezing temps doesn't always mean cold anymore. It can just mean that you're in the ghost room. Keep walking around with the thermometer out and keep an eye on it to see if it starts dropping. If it does, we're probably near at the ghost room. I Maybe it is the basement since that's where they responded and it's where the cursed thing is. Thank you for your input, Grimace. That's, that's pretty incredible. I'm putting the journal in the summoning circle. All right. Can you write in the journal, please? If you're here, can you write in the journal? I don't know what the name is. Can you go to the truck and um, tell me what the name is that's written on the bulletin board thing? Are you here? Can you write in the journal? Can you pretty please write in the journal? Repeat that. Sarah Hall. Sarah? Yes. All right. Sarah, if you're here, can you please write in the spirit journal? I have the lights on. Why do I keep doing that? Sarah, are you here? That's not how you place the journal. Is that not? That's how I've been doing it. Have I been doing it wrong the whole time? Oh, is it F? Oh my God, I'm stupid. I'm stupid, chat. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. Can you write in the journal, please? If you're there, can you write in the journal? What is your name? Oh, hi. Sarah, are you there? I don't think this is the spirit room. I'm gonna leave that there for now, but I don't know. We need to keep looking around. Did you, by chance, um, can you put that uh, camera back here on the corner? The, um, thank you. Slay. I should turn back off the lights. Oh, she's hunting, she's hunting. Oh. It's up to you. If you want to stay and try to figure it out, you can. I think um, I might be able to still hear you in game. I don't know. I hear her. Oh no! I don't think she's very close. She's She's coming from the kitchen. You're okay for now. You might be able to leave the house now. I don't think she's hunting anymore. The door's locked though. Then yeah, she's still hunting. 
Or if it might not be locked, you may just have to pull it. Hades, do you no, know there's a that? lock. Yeah, but it it says that even when it's like it might. Sorry, one second, guys. Hades literally barked because he wanted to talk about a toy, and he set off every single dog in his house. I don't think she's hunting. Like, if you if you click on the door, you should be able to pull it open or push it open. You just have to hold down. Oh, she's hunting. Never mind. There she is. Oh, she's coming. She's going to get you. I'm so sorry. Hold on one second. Sorry, friends. I'm going to have to go settle them down. Literally nothing happened. Hades did this. So, please, sorry. Welcome back. I've prepared some jobs for you. Oh, you're floating. <laughs> Okay, not our finest hour. Um, however, here, I'm gonna mute back on Discord, sorry. Um, I'm gonna get my other friend in here. Wait, what happened? What the fuck is wrong with people? Um, okay, I'm gonna give... I think my chat is either frozen or nobody is here. And I'm not sure which it is. Oh, you know what? Um, I'll have to... I have to make a new lobby. Very fast. quiet first just to make sure my audio is okay i think it's working i can hear okay. you at least hello i apologize <laughs> i know you had to destroy the room oh no it's okay we didn't lose anything i just had to um i just set it to like two max people before oh. so like 
I appreciate you uh, opening it up. No, thank you so much for coming. Honestly, having a having a other than level one, but I was over a thousand before. I was gonna say we used to play this a lot. Over a hundred and seventy-six hours. Oh damn it! Um, I accidentally leaked the code. We have to leave. I'm sorry. Oh, it's yeah. It's <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Literally, I thought I had checked it too, and then the minute that I <laughs> oops. All right, let me create a new one, yeah. Sorry, guys. We're probably going to have in total um, three people, but... Um, yeah. I just wanted to get, like, um, somebody who... Cap and I used to play this game together all the time. This is my friend Cap. I was going to introduce you guys, and then... Copying this damn code is so annoying. It always takes me a few times. Okay. Okay, okay. We're no so posters. back. We're so back. Oh my god, I leaked the code again. <laughs> Why do they leave it up? I keep leaking it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, see you in a second. See you in a second. I'm so sorry. You guys, I'm so bad at this. I swear I'll get it right. I will, and I'll turn up everybody's volumes and stuff. Um, my friend Cap and I used to play this game all the time, like all the time together. Okay, the minute that I see this code. I swear to God. Okay, I'm doing everything I can. Get the heck off my screen. Okay, we're good. I swear to God, we're good. I swear we're good. <laughs> okay. The code's covered? Yes, yes, I'm sure. Okay. I'm sure we're good now. <laughs> I'm positive we're good. Did I do it again? Did I do it again? I did it again. I thought I had changed so, my screen. I'm so bad at this. Yeah. <laughs> Why am I, I didn't have any trouble with this the other night. I thought the entire time that I was on a different screen than I was. What the hell am I doing so wrong? It's, I've never had this much trouble with it. I swear to you, one day, I'm going to figure this out. Hold on. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> I had no trouble with this before. I don't know what it is. I'm literally, I'm not even like, okay. Okay. Jesus. Okay. Okay, fourth time is definitely the charm. Fourth time is so the charm. Are you still on your beautiful face? I'm still on my beautiful face. I, I know okay. that the code says a bunch of question marks. So I think we have to be good. Okay. 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 Oh, hi. Hello. Oh, you appeared right behind me. 
Static said, what is going on? I have no idea, <laughs> actually. I literally leaked the code like four times. <laughs> okay, so, um, give me just a second here. How do I access the store here? Store. So now you click on the bulletin board in the middle and you, um, you go from the bulletin board in the middle, you use the, um, the arrows on the right hand side to get oh, over to like the store and then adding things is a pain in the ass. I also think I lost everything because I was so dead last time. Oh, I died I immediately. Anyway, so. Do you have any, the you don't have anything? Things, okay. No, I, oh, I want to say the major things we would need is an EMF. You don't really need flashlights. Like I can play blind. <laughs> I don't um, believe you. Actually, I feel like the static <laughs> tried to play without a flashlight, and he had a hard time. Oh, I don't know. I've, I've played it before, so we'll see how it goes. But I would say, if anything, is a thermometer a uh, book? Or is that what is that? A notepad? Ready? Book, so okay. we have the UV light, the EMF thing, the um, the ghost writing thing, um, like the ghost writing journal. The items look different, but it's pretty much the same as it used to be. I'm going to buy two flashlights. We all have one. I'm also going to buy a second um, EMF. I can't believe I lost everything I bought last time. That's so sad. Oh, I'm sorry. No, 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 no. I died immediately. <laughs> I literally, like, I heard the ghost hunt, it's like, start to hunt, and I just, like, started hiding. I just, like, I was like, okay. I feel like you, three uh, players will be you fine. Can, you, if you want to add a uh, photo camera, that would probably be good. We don't have any, we don't have yeah. access to it anymore. Oh, we no. like we are too low level to buy a video camera. That's crazy. Let's see. Oh, we have a lot of places unlocked. Grafton, Ridgeview, Edgefield. I luckily I know all these maps, so it'll be easy navigating them. I think we're gonna go in with one of everything but flashlights. I added us, um, wait, I have not added every flashlight. Can I throw this flashlight in the truck and we just get it? I can't hear you, you walked away from me. I still can't hear you. Oh, I threw the flashlight in the truck, or the black light in the truck, hopefully we get it. Was there, I don't, I don't, I don't think so. I know, we probably won't, but there's always a chance. I'm crossing oh, my fingers. Oh, I was doing this incorrectly. It was like, why can I not get another flashlight in? But that's why. Okay, we're good. Okay, 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 okay. So, I think that the only access that um, Hecate has access, or the only map that Hecate has access to is Tanglewood. But I, if we could pick a different map, that would be fun. Because I've been playing this map for like three days straight. But as long as it works... For her, like, I, if it doesn't let you, we certainly could just go back to Tanglewood. Yeah. Or we could just try really hard to complete Tanglewood. Like, do we just complete it and then move on? I am good with any of the choices. You know what? I don't feel like I can leave this one. I, I don't feel like I can leave Tanglewood Drive behind. I really don't. I really, really don't. You just don't. can't let it beat you? No, I can't. I really can't. <laughs> I, like, I need to, I, I have to, I have to complete it before we move on. Okay, I press ready up, so you'll ready nope. up, yeah. Cap, yeah, on just, like, the main screen, and then I'll, I'll try to tell you, like, the differences, kind of, when we get in. It'll be yep. fun. We'll be fine. We have three people. We will certainly win this one. There's no way we, we don't this. win this one. Okay, and then I press start. Five hours later, Loey is still dying. <laughs> Holly, no. <laughs> I'm gonna do push to talk so I can thank There we go, everyone loaded in fast. I'm already going crazy. I believe in us. Real. Give me one sec to read um, the chat and I'll be back. Um, 
Amanda said, Loey, my love, it leaked again. Which, which leak was that? Who knows, Jazz honestly. Phillips. Also, um, Alyssa Renee said, hi, Loey. Not sure how much longer you'll be on, but love your company. Wait. I remember if you team Escape the Ghost. They don't know I'm talking. That sounds awesome. All right. They don't know I'm talking. I just turned it. Wait, can I do that? Yes, okay. Sorry. Alyssa said, hi, Loey. Not sure how much longer you'll be on, but I love your company while I work my night shift. Have a good night shift, Alyssa. I love you. Thanks for being here. Raina said, Loey, you're doing your star, your sawdust best, and we love you. Me reading it as stardust. I'm like, my stardust best, tee -hee. <laughs> Okay. There, and then, actually, I'm going to turn it back on. Well, no, I'll do... Yeah, I want to do voice activation. I'm just so bad. I'll forget to do it. Okay, so yeah, that it's all pretty much the same, Cap. Uh, Jazz Phillips responds to everyone. I wonder if, is that just a view of the house? I don't know what that photo is. Maybe we could have added more photos if we had a camera or something. It's and the then, front hallway, it looks like. I don't, maybe that means, I don't think that it means the ghost is in there. I think that would be crazy. Um, so we all take a flashlight. Um... I'll take the spirit box. Do you have the EMF? Yep. Every time that you scroll away from the EMF, I don't know if it used to be like this actually, but every time you scroll away from it, you will have to turn it back on. So like if you're uh, scrolling through items. That. What? Because it used to always stay on. When did you, you scrolled not like want back it? And... Did you, did, was it not supposed to? Well, you know how whenever you had like a spirit box on and you wanted to scroll to a different item and then you would have it still on, it would make the static sound while you were on another yeah. item? Oh! So now you don't have that yeah. anymore. Yeah! But the spirit box, so if you scroll away from it, it's still like, it still oh, stays it's on. still on. Ooh, that's weird. Well, it doesn't say... That would be my one. It doesn't like say on on, but like if you scroll back to it, it's still on. Yeah, it's still on. I love um, Hecate like in the table. <laughs> Your entire character yeah. model just went in there. So I think we're good for now. Hecate, if you want to bring the thermometer, maybe? Yeah. And then we've got this one. We've got this one. Surely oh, yeah. this is the one we win. Oh, yes. Let's do this. Slay. 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 Um, the only Yay. thing, wait, Hecate, just so you are, I was going to tell you this and then the ghost started hunting. If it starts to hunt, the best thing to do is turn off your flashlight and try to hide. But you can also like run from it and try to loop it and shit. I don't really know how to do that. That's for advanced players. Um. Oh, oh, can I? Already? Can I? Nope, they won't let me pick this up. No, I was trying to save the cat photo. No, you can't pick up items anymore. There are, like, I've been seeing, I guess, that they have items in, um, like, drawers and stuff now that we can use. Like, Ooh. Ouija boards and stuff like that. I, that's not, like, a new, new thing. I just haven't played the game in a couple months. I love chat. Just, like, you go, girl. You get that win. Do you have yeah, the, they have um... The, they have the tarot cards now, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, they do. Oh, ghosty. I'm going to waste your water. <laughs> Anybody there? Oh. oh, sorry. I don't know why I'm in the same room as you guys. Here. Let me, let me. We're, we're, we're a team. We're, we're, we're spreading out. <laughs> we're exploring. I'm the first to die in the horror movie. I'm going to pick a terrible place. I'm going to go to the basement. That's a great idea. Okay. Anybody there? Oh my god. I just saw your body and I thought it was a shadow person. <laughs> Let me know if the temp starts dropping anywhere in particular. I'm hearing something in the kitchen or the dining room. You're hearing what? I'm hearing something above me. Where are you? Oh, you, you <gasps> this doing... door just opened on its own. I think it's okay. in here. I think it's in I'm, here. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting uh, readings in here. Are you here? It's clicking. Oh. L wait, let's check the garage too. Anybody here? 
What's your name? How old are you? Do you turn off the light? What? I was asking you to turn off the light. Oh. What happened? I don't know, there's some stuff on the floor. I thought it was something. It looks like it's just a texture. Maybe this isn't where it is. I mean, I don't know. Where did you get the EMF spike? Yeah, it was right here. Could it be in the hallway here? I just put down the spirit journal. Let's see if it does anything with that. Did you just throw that? Whoa! What? Nope. Uh, I'm getting readings right here. What I'm getting is... about four. Oh, it's a four. Yeah. Let me know if it pops up to five. Yeah. Are you here? So it looks like it's wrong. Wait, what? It looks like it's wrong. Oh, I got another three here. So probably right here-ish. I mean, the door opened when I walked past. Ah, I'm trying to open up these drawers. Temperature is slowly dropping. Ooh. Wait, should we put We haven't gotten any kind of evidence yet, have we? Oh. Something just got thrown. It might have been us brushing oh. past it as well. Here we go, there's a five. It's a five? Okay. So yeah. go to your journal. The evidence is in a different spot, but you can put down EMF. What'd you say? Temperature is down to five. Down to it five? Looks like we're getting oh, uh, we're getting fog on our breath, so I'm, I'm assuming it's getting cold. It's probably cold. Keep, see if it drops down to wait. It might be over here. See if it's any I'm colder in here. Yeah, over by the counter. It might be. I don't know. Because freezing breath doesn't necessarily, like, mean freezing yeah, breath anymore. Yeah. It's such an obvious giveaway. <laughs> Are you friendly? Are you there? Are you here? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. It's a child. What?! It is a small child who was in the kitchen. I'm running. Are you here? Can you write in the journal? Can you write in the journal? I just left the house. I love how both of you took off and I'm just here. I'm just opening some closets so we have a runway. Do you have the video camera? I, I do. Should we put it here, maybe on the edge, and see if we catch any spirit orbs or anything, or maybe like here-ish? Oh, you that's press. Great idea. Here, what I'll do is I'll see if I can put it up here. You press um... F to place now, and you and we can toggle the night vision from oh, the van. Are you here? Are you a child? There we go. I wish we had a um, a photo camera. That would've been cool. Can you write in the journal, please? Can you write in the journal? <laughs> How could you just standing there? Did it get below zero? Oh, no. What did it do? It still hasn't gone below five. What else do we have? You can keep looking at it. Did you bring anything else? Oh, so I'm just gonna put it right here where the... Did you guys hear that? Can you show us a sign? Are you here? Oh, that was a sign. Where oh, that was a sign. I want someone to check in the van. Actually, I think I'm I'm going to check in the yeah. van. Can I grab the spirit box off you? Yeah. But um I'm going to check in the van to see for orbs and maybe regain a little bit of sanity. Hi chat. See, we finally figured it out. We're doing great. Activities at a zero. You guys are good for now. Okay. And then Are there any orbs? I'm checking for orbs right now. I don't see anything so far. 
I like them walking around in the kitchen. They feel like little sims. <laughs> Confirmed activity in the kitchen for sure. I mean, I thought the little red child was confirmed activity, but that's so real. The camera is glitching. You guys be careful. I wonder if it's hunting. <gasps> that's an orb! They died. They died. We have orbs. So... <laughs> R.I.P. Hecate. Okay, so it's either... Where are you? Is it still I'm hunting? Alive, but it's, it's not happy. Alright, get back to the van when you can. So... I'm just in the closet. I'm just looking through the book here. So we don't have freezing temps to knock. So it's either an Obek or... I was gonna tell him... I was going to tell him. You're dead, aren't you? No, I'm not. Oh, thank God. Okay, stop talking till it's done hunting. <laughs> Could you open the front door for me, please? Wait. You can't get out? You'll give me a straight bolt. <sighs> open the front door. Run! <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh, that makes sense. Um, that makes sense. Okay. So we do have orbs. Um, that means that it's either poor Hecate. Uh, she said she's gone ghost mode. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, okay. So ultraviolet's an option, right? Uh, so it's either. Hold on. Sorry. It's a Raiju or an Obake. Obake would be ultraviolet. Raiju would be dots projector. So we can both take one of those in. Where is the dots? Oh, does Hecate have the dots projector? Yeah, uh, if they ha uh, if it was on the wall, then they had it. Yeah. Okay. Oh my uh, god, the little question at? mark. We're not doing great, I would say. I think we gotta get in and out of this pretty quick, because uh, we don't have any access to sanity medication or anything. Sounds great. All right, I'm gonna stay low. So, my recommendation is, if it starts hunting... <gasps> oh! Oh my god, it closed, Cap! No! I heard her humming and the door just closed! It brought me a book. What? It brought me a book. Where are you? I'm just going to circle Obake just in case he heads out. He's just here in the closet. That Are we all dead? All right, if you can hear me, it's most likely the dot projector because uh, there was no you. The dot projector was... So right, you. We should. Can you hear me, Hecate? <laughs> okay. I think we got it. I think we're good. R.I.P. Okay, let's see if we got it. <laughs> that was so funny. That was so Hello. funny. Oh, it was. You were right. It was a Raiju. 
Oh no! I didn't oh. see any UV. What? Oh, my bad. Wait, Raiju was the the one who was Dot's projector. I thought. Oh, we got the photo camera finally! Oh, I messed up. <laughs> I hit UV by accident. Oh my oh, god! god. That's okay. It's okay. I still made fifty bucks. Okay. Do you guys still get points for getting the right choice? Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. Did you oh, good, did good, you good, end good. up putting it down or putting anything down, Hecate? I don't know if you no. heard him at the end. So oh, if you no. die, you can still guess the ghost and it'll give you money. All you have to do is go into journal and then put down like evidence that you have and you can see what ghost it could be. So we got like, we got like, we got orbs and I think we got um, EMF five and that narrowed it down to two. So. Okay. Okay, I'm at $25. That's okay, that's okay. I got 300, baby. I'm sugar mama. I'm. I'm to damn. I know. I don't mean to brag, but all right. I bought us a photo camera. Should we get? Should we do a small laser pen that projects a small beam of light into the environment? Ghost activity scan for physical form that may appear. Hmm. We had one of those in there last time, right? What did you say? We had one of those laser pens in there last time, right? What laser pens? The um the dots? The, oh dot projector. Oh we did we had one, one but then right I didn't know where to find it. Um after I a certain point. I don't want to buy too much. I spent a bunch body. of wait, what'd you say? I think it was it was on Hecate's body. <laughs> yeah. I I accidentally picked it up. Yeah, I made that judgment call on not seeing UV, <laughs> so I was like, like we <laughs> it's gonna be dots. But, you know, instead of clicking dots, I clicked UV instead, so that was my Oh, bad. that's funny. I literally, I, I went into the journal, and I, um, I... Click dots? Yeah, I can't believe that. That's the first <laughs> one I've gotten right. I literally just beat this game. That's crazy. Yes. Okay, so we... That means you beat Tanglewood. That means I beat Tanglewood. That means we can move on. We're done. Yep. We're literally fine, and we're done, and we're complete. Oh, that's how help. you do it. Nice. Okay, hold on one second. Sorry, I'm still figuring out the um. Oh, take your time. The. I'm trying not to bring all four of my flashlights, but I don't know how to undo it. Is like, there a minus option in the? Uh, mm -mm. Store? So it says I'm. I. It doesn't even say I'm bringing any of them, but I am. And then if I press remove, it doesn't do anything. If we leave it in the truck, will it still come back? Well, if I die, I lose it. Oh, I will just lose Oh, it. I can't see my... Oh, okay. I think I figured it out. I think we're good. I think I, I figured it out. That... Oh, that's three floors. Two floors. Two Did I sell floors. all my flashlights? What? Okay, add. I can't see over. <laughs> I can't use that. <laughs> all right. Um... Where should we go? Should we go to maybe the Grafton farmhouse? That's 13 rooms and two sets of, or two floors. That's what I was thinking. It's probably the the best one besides Beesdale. I can't see through your head. <laughs> why Why does it do that? No, it's fine. I just, I can't believe no. it does that. Because the same thing just even, happened on this screen. Why does it, that's so Even when you confusing. click on it, really? Yes, yeah. You were, your head was blocking. Well, it isn't anymore. Hecate's is still there, but... He when I click on the... I don't see Hecate, they vanish. What? Yeah. Oh, now you're down on the ground. You were hovering. I'm hovering? You were you were hovering. Okay. Well, that's weird. I can't believe we saw a little kid and we didn't even take a photo. Hit, hit space bar for me. That takes me back to the... Okay, okay, and okay. Uh, I was going to say Hecate could stand in front of the board again. Well, I don't know. I mean, it, it is what it is. Like, the, I think the two, yeah. the one point or whatever is finally coming out. They're probably gonna fix a lot of this. Good night to any chat who's leaving. Thanks for hanging out. All right, let's try out the Grafton farmhouse and see where we're at. We have, we still have one of everything: one dots projector, one EMF, one ghost writing book, one spirit box, thermometer, UV light, video camera, whatever. But now we have three flashlights. We have two photo cameras. Did you add one of those, or was that were they both me? 
a you or Hecate. Okay, that would have been me because I I think I'm the only one who's gotten up to level three. Okay. Yeah, it wasn't me. <laughs> All right. Whenever you guys are ready, let's ready up. Oh, you guys are readied up. I'm so sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I'm stupid. <laughs> yeah, time to go. Let's go. Ooh, Ellen West responds to everyone. Check out of the code. Keen witness a ghost event. Find evidence of paranormal with an EMF reader. Perfect. I'll grab the EMF again and a camera. I have a camera and I have the I don't know if 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 you want to take the camera, I'll leave a camera for now. Um and maybe because we have I, to set up. So I got the video I'll camera, the EMF reader, and my flashlight. Okay. I'll grab the thermometer again. Okay, slay, thank you. What my game is lagging so bad now out of nowhere. Mine just did that too. Really? I think it was it was a lag spike. Okay. I think it's a server issue. Gotcha. Sense. You have a good computer. You can't blame your computer. <laughs> I was just so. Ooh, <laughs> new map. New map. Oh my god, this is terrifying. Oh god. Okay, <laughs> good to know the fuse box is outside the house. Not very helpful uh, if we get hunted, but whatever. Does that turn on the porch lights? No, that turns on the inside lights. God, yeah, this house uh, is the porch dark. Lights, I, think, I thought they were right here. That's a creepy little family photo. Yeah, there's a really creepy room really back over here. Are you there? Oh, all the lights are on. What am I doing? Actually, I don't even need to use this yet. I feel so useless. Yeah, this place is huge. Are you here? Are you friendly? What's your name? How old are you? Another fuse box in here. Oh, a fly strip. Yummy. <laughs> Delish. Did anybody happen to go upstairs? What? Did you go upstairs? No, not yet. stairs in here. I'm coming with you. I don't want to be alone. Hello? Are you here? Did you have to take a pee? Is there anybody here? Did you have to go potty, ghost? Oh my god, I thought that fan was a woman. I thought I thought that fan was literally I literally saw that fan and I said, that is Ellen herself. That there she is. Can you give me a sign? Are you here? If there's any fun items to do anything with. Not really. Man, this looks haunted though. Kind of cool. I'm sorry? I was saying this looks haunted. Oh no, I was, I was doing the flicker. <laughs> I was trying to encourage it. This room is pretty big.
wish I had the EMF or something to walk around with. I feel so useless for finding the ghost. How's the time, Peckety? Um, it's been pretty steady at 20 so far. Ghost hunting simulator, it's fun. Is the fuse blown or mine? I just was not looking right. I don't want to turn on too many lights, but. Let's see if there's something in here for us to play with! Give me something to play with! I want a Ouija board! Where are you guys? So I think we're gonna have to start looking for signs in regards to uh, like things on the floor. I don't think we're getting any major readings. I think it's the one tier one items. Apparently, it just takes a while to like get anything with them. And plus, because we're it? playing on amateur, it's a really long setup, so it may just the activity may just not have started yet. Um, oh, that's the carried door. away. Yeah, if you if you want to change items though, if you want, I can take the EMF and you can take the spare box. Okay. Yep. Yeah, there you go. Right. Ellen, Are you anywhere in here, girl? I don't think I really wanted a sketch on. It's a nice place you got here. Would be a shame if somebody hunted you out of it. I attempted Ellen. I know where she is. You found her? Ellen, are you here? She's uh she's in here. It jumped up to five when the event happened though. I where was are like you? in here, I think. Maybe I was in here, maybe I was um How old I, are you? I don't know where I was now that I'm thinking about it, but it definitely jumped up to five. I think it's it's gotta be you know five. Is it Ellen Woods? I think so. I can't remember where I was. I was in a kitchen when it happened. Oh kitchen's here, right here. Right I, I right was right. like right yeah, I was like in here ish and oh. I what? I just heard something right over here. Where are you? How did you get through that door? How old are you? Yeah, I was you like in here-ish, like in one of these two rooms. That was me. Oh my god. <laughs> that was so scary. <laughs> Can you give me also, a sign? Also, <laughs> it's EMF 5. EMF jumped all the way up oh. to 5 during the ghost event. Um, I'm going to put down the journal in here. If we have the video camera, too, we can pop yep. it on an edge. I think uh, this I is the room, anyway. The is the temp dropping at all? Did the lights just flicker? Lights it's yeah, got to be I this so. room. Yeah. What'd you say? All right, camera is set. Hecate? Can you give us a sign? Yeah, the lights flickered. Oh, I thought you were saying something about the town. <laughs> no. All right, I'm going to go outside and go um, get something else in terms of equipment. Yeah, I'm going to turn off the lights if you can look for How do I get back out to the car? Is this the wrong side of the house? Is there a backyard in this house? Uh, I think there is. Forward. There's a backyard. Yeah, uh, there is an entrance on the other side. Oh, activities crawling up. Be careful in there. Oh, we're none of us are in there. Okay. 
Um, okay, I'm going to bring, if we want to bring the dots projector, that's good. Um, if we know we have EMF 5, we probably don't need it anymore. I definitely want to go all the way up when, whatever that. may have or is that more? Turn off the tape. Yeah, looks like we do. Where? Look near the door straight ahead. I don't see anything. Little dot floating around right there. It's not the it's not the glare, right? I don't see anything. I may have to move it, but it's like straight where so if you're looking straight, like right in the middle of the screen, you can see like little floaty things go off. I don't see anything. I believe you though. If you see orbs, I'm like gonna if, adjust the camera though. I'm I'm gonna. I'm are gonna you sure? Because if you saw things yeah. float, if you if you saw things floating around, it's definitely orbs. Oh no no. I, all right. Okay. Oh, the light just went out. All right. Yeah, you're going towards it now. You're good. Oh my god. It feels like I'm watching like a found footage horror movie. So that direction Okay. I'm watching. The power went out. I think I did just see an orb, but I'm I'm going to watch it another second. I definitely saw something floaty. But I, I, the other times I've seen orbs, it's been really specific. Um, our sanity isn't too- Yeah, there was one. Yeah, you just saw one? Orb. Okay, all right, cool. So we have EMF level five, um, and then oh, ghost yeah. orb. So that leaves us with a Raiju or an Obake, just like freaking last time. Okay. Yeah, Raiju, I just looked around for uh, the ultraviolet and I didn't see anything, but let's confirm it with the pen. Well, <laughs> The the ultraviolet might just take a while to see. Like you might have to like just look around for a while. I'll take the dots projector in, but I mean that's good to know. I think. I'm gonna go with you. Though. I'm not gonna leave you by yourself. Okay. We'll hold hands and do this together. Tee hee. Oh, the spirit the the spirit box. The fuse is out. I think it's right out here. Oh. <gasps> what? What happened? Just yelled in my ear. Is this not the... You can't use it? No, it's in the closet in the other room. Wait, so it's just for show? Yeah, they teased us with that. What the hell? Oh my god, there's a bug. I don't really know how the dots projector works. I believe... I believe you just put it up somewhere like you would do the other one. How do you do it? Probably with F, huh? Let me see. Is it is it in this room? Yeah, yeah, I believe it's in this room for sure. Okay. I think I can hear you also. I don't think you need to use the Oh walkie. yeah, sorry, sorry. No, no, it's yeah, okay. That's Okay. Should it be somewhere where we can watch it on the camera? Is that how we I'd say put it beside the camera here. The camera's right here. Where is it? Right over there. Like I don't know if it'll if face. If you hold F, you should be able to twist it. You know, yeah, it. sorry, I'm not good at this. Oh, no, 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 it's okay. Slay. Slay. All right, I say we safely go to the truck. <laughs> yeah, probably well, go watch fight. for the dots in there, right? Yeah, we don't need to die in here. Well, the only other thing um, to do is check for ultraviolet, but we can we can check the cams. We can all check the cams from the safety of the chuck. Why not? Uh, how do I toggle night vision like that? I really can't see anything from there. Might have to go inside. I don't know. I don't know. Does the dots work? 
You know what? I think it's we're gonna have to move it. We oh here, not gonna take the camera with me. You know what? Worst case scenario, I die and I get a picture. That's so real. Um... Just have I guess the <laughs> ultraviolet out unless you want me to try to use it. Um, probably you to use it because okay. I uh, won't be able to. UV right here. Oh okay, the spirit box was on the floor. We we don't have to. Run upstairs, 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 upstairs. And get in the washroom. Shut the door. Did he die? All right. Shit. All right, let's get out of here. Down the stairs. Okay. All right. Poor cap. Oh shit. I wonder if that dots projector is ever going to do anything. I don't feel like that's how you use it now. I feel like you have to like We don't have any sanity pills. We're so low. She's hunting so much too. I'm gonna. Oh, hi, Cap. I love that teddy bear. Thank you so much. Is that for me? Oh my God, he's so cute. Thank you. I love him. I'm gonna see if I can see anything on the dots projector since that was the room. Um, I'm gonna just watch the cameras for a sec, but. might be screwed I don't want to die because I brought so much stuff I don't want to die because I brought so much stuff okay so if it was dots projector it would be Raiju ultraviolet would be Obake but Cap looked around with the ultraviolet for a while I'm gonna go yell at her before we leave. I'm gonna go yell at her. Ellen, you're a bitch. Takes off immediately. Let's see if we randomly get a photo of a ghost. I love a pic of her, but all right. I, I honestly think we pick Raiju and leave. I, I think, I think, what would Raiju be? Raiju would be Dot's projector. And if Cap was saying he didn't find anything with the ultraviolet, the ultraviolet's pretty straightforward. All right. Um, we're going to pick Raiju. Is everyone with me? Yep. Do you know how? It's uh, the journal. and the, uh, I don't think, you don't have to mark down the evidence. Maybe you do. But it's EMF5, Dot's projector, Ghost Orb, and then you can circle Raiju. Okay. Okay, Slay. Slay. I think we're good. I think I feel pretty good about Raiju. I just don't want to lose all my cameras and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, no. I get that. I think we've got this. I think we got this. We did not get I this. chose right. What, I chose right. <laughs> so it was in the dining room. I took it. I did a 50 50. I know you guys were choosing that, so I chose That's the opposite. That's so funny. It was an Obake. That's crazy. So, when I died, I seen it spawn in the dining room and uh -huh. I tried to throw stuff to get you guys to come to the dining room. 
Oh. Well, the bear was for you. I'm oh. happy you got that. I thought I thought you were giving me the teddy bear as a gift. No, the, te no, the teddy bear was for you, but the pop okay. can wasn't. The pop can is uh, me throwing it. I don't like how large that map was. That map was too there's, big, there's I think. There's a smaller one. Yeah, we could do um, the tiniest map, the 10 room. The Willow Street is our, like, end of the night yeah, game. Yeah, that sounds good. Yeah? You guys down for that? Yeah. Okay. That. Okay, all right. We'll do Willow Street then. Let me make sure we have everything we need. Um. How much money do I have? Let's see. Uh, why did I... I never know how to Ooh. use this thing. Yeah, it is really weird, isn't it? The new interface is really confusing. I, I don't think I fully understand it, but... You know, I think it would be helpful if we either had a second EMF or a second thermometer. What do you think is more useful? Maybe an EMF? Because especially in the beginning when we're trying to find, like, the spirit... Second EMF is probably more right? helpful. Right? I think so too. Than the thermometer. Okay. So we added a second EMF. We have we have two photo cameras still, four flashlights, because I, I don't fucking know what I'm doing. Um Here, I'm gonna add, uh, a f or no, I was gonna add my own flashlight so you weren't spending your money. I realized how the interface works now. I, I, oh, I finally figured out how to add just one. It's okay. We, we have, we have, we're, we're totally good. Um, let's see. We have a second EMF reader. Wow, okay, um, we're good. good. All right, I'm readying up. <laughs> okay, yay. Last game, last game. Okay. Good night, Rebel. Thanks for modding tonight. Love you guys so much. Kylantis, please don't talk about Five Guys right now. I can't order out. That sounds so freaking good. Five Guys. Oh my god. Grant Williams, everyone. Kathy, you know where I went last night in the middle of the night? I went to Bob's Big Boy. In. Oh no. <laughs> the way your entire body collapsed. I want, collapsed. Fi I've, <laughs> I want Five Guys now. I want Five Guys. Oh, no. Oh, no. Five Guys just sounds so good, man. All right. Wow, we have you, are have stocked up. Have you uh, tried Texas Chainsaw Massacre yet? No, I want to, though. It's on Game Pass. No uh, way. I, uh, I definitely love it so far. It had a lot of um, Dead by Daylight vibes. Good night to everyone who's leaving. I love you. We should play Dead by Daylight sometime, too. Um, so it looks like this photo is of the living room. I don't know if the photos are giving us hints as to where the ghost is, or if it's like, maybe this is like where they've had activity, but it looks like that's the living room with the fireplace. The ghost name is Grant Williams. All right. I don't remember the picture of Beesdale, but I remember that it was the hallway of, um... It was a hallway, Tangerine. right? It was it was the hallway. I don't remember what it was for the last one either, but it was the hallway of Tanglewood. But I don't remember where the ghost was in that game. It was in the hallway. It was in the kitchen hallway. Or no, oh, it was more you're in the kitchen. right. Okay, last game. Last All I game. remember is running. <laughs> All right, this one is a little bit more of a creepier place because it has like a you reckon corridor to the back. Let's see if we get any activity. Hello, ghosty ghouly. Twenty degrees. You might have to. Um, the thermometer goes down slowly now. It doesn't like insta read the temp. You'll want to like stay in a room for a sec to see if it goes down, basically. And if you start seeing it crawling down, you can stay. But if it doesn't start crawling down immediately, it's not the room. I, I love speaking. Yeah, I would have just been walking in and out. Oh, no. I, I love to talk. I love to talk. <laughs> Talking is you. my favorite. <laughs> I'm walking around without the EMF even out. 
Feed it's me okay, black stones and the fire will grow. In return, I will heat this snowed in Howlin' home. Okay, then. That's cool. What is that? Feed me black stones. Oh, it was through your... <laughs> It was through, it was through your mic cap. I thought I heard something. Oh, bro, oh, that's not good. I gotta. It's probably my TV, so I'm gonna make sure it's muted. Um. Night killers, love you. How you doing, ghosty ghoulies? There's a safe here. I wonder if we can get the code. That would be fun. That the EMF does anything. I'm trying to be smart about actually looking for items because there's so many things we can toy around with. You are. Hi. Hello. I haven't had the EMF go off at all. <gasps> oh! Now I am. Is it here? It's like right here. We're at 10 degrees. It's this oh, room, yeah. I think. What was that guy's name again? I don't remember. It might be too early to start saying his name, actually. It's in the hallway? Oh, no. Yeah, it's in the hallway. Are you sure? Yeah, because... Yeah, I'm definitely sure. Oh. What happened? They moved this door here. I got a three on the EMF. Are you here? Uh, let's turn off the light so I can go... So I can use the skate box. I got a three on the door. Where's the temperature is dropping? Let me know if it gets below zero. Or let us know. You don't have to just let me know. Can you get it? <laughs> yeah. Are you there? Alyssa Renee just gifted five memberships. What do you think about that? Ghost. Alyssa. They just opened that door over there. What? Yeah, they did. I got three again. Are you here? Are you in this room? Are you friendly? Are you here? What do you want? What's your name? How old are you? Do you want to be friends? We're dropping below five degrees, I believe. Oh, I'm okay. yeah, below, five. below zero is freezing, I think. But maybe it's, it's out dropping. here. Let's go in this room over here. Oh, yep, I just saw my breath. This is definitely the area. Are you here? Yeah, I was going up in that room. It's still dropping over here. Are you friendly? Yeah, it's uh, freezing temps. Freezing? Okay. Writing that in the journal. Freezing temps. Um, did we get EMF level 5? I don't think so. No, I haven't uh, had any major activity yet. Only on this door, which has been a 3. Huh. Can we get another sign there, bud? Can we just get a little pokey? A little poof? Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are, are you here? Give us a sign. Are you here? It's close. <gasps> oh! You heard that? Yeah. Are you friendly? Do you want to be friends? You were walking in between rooms. <gasps> you may actually be in that room. The fucking mannequin just moved. I shit you not. I 
Or was it my flashlight? I swear to you, it looked like the mannequin just moved. No, it has EMF readings on it, so I wouldn't be surprised. Did you just move that? To the page crack. Can you hear me? Yeah, it's definitely ghost. Um, it's definitely EMF. We should get a camera down here. Yeah. Right. Those lights on. Get out of the house. <laughs> really taking the ambiance. Let's see. I feel good about the spirit box. We probably don't need that anymore. I'll take the EM, I'll keep an EMF on me. Um, well, I wonder if I should walk around with a glow stick instead. Let's see. Uh, ghost orbs is still an option. I think Dot I'm gonna leave not my flashlight and I'm gonna take uh, the yeah, ultraviolet. Is. Ultraviolet is. Ghost rating is, uh, I'll grab the book because I don't need the dot projector. Okay. There we go. Why don't we need so the I have dot a camera projector. and the book? Uh, does anybody have a photographic camera on them? Uh, no. Wait. Why don't we need a dot projector? Uh, because if I click dot projector, it doesn't give a. It, it deletes all the options. On oh, the, nice. Uh, so we don't need it. Okay. Evidence. Okay. I have a camera. I have um. I have a camera. I have an EMF, and I have an ultraviolet instead of a Perfect. flashlight to see if we can get fingerprints. The writing book. Writing book also, um, chat is correcting me. The 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 mannequin did not move. I truly got I, jump scared by my own flashlight. I thought it did too. <laughs> you had me believe. I really thought it moved. Chat, holler if you see fingerprints. I guess I should go to the area where it's actually um, haunted, though. Hello. Hello. All right, so the camera is set up. Hopefully that's there. Actually, no, I may need to fix it. Really? You know, maybe it was a bad idea not to bring a flashlight. Maybe I fucked up a little bit. You want bit. mine? No, it's okay. You I just flashlight? didn't see anything. I thought I'd be able to see fingerprints. Here, take my flashlight. No, that's okay. I don't know if the, the UV will work if I take a flashlight, will it? Uh, yeah, it'll still work. It will? Here. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I don't have any hands for it, actually. I'm going to leave what, uh, the photo camera um, here. I'll take that. There we go. It's gonna run at me, at least I'll get a shot. Oh, there we go. Oh, you have to activate it. Oh my God, I feel silly. Now I understand. I didn't realize you had to activate the glow stick. I thought it just worked. Is it fingerprints around the door handle still? And, or not door handle, the, the middle of the door? Or... I don't know. I, I haven't really gotten them. I think the last time I played it was with Static. Well, it was the last time I played with, was with Static, but I think he used it, not me. I'm looking on all the walls, though. Do we have a video camera or anything else? Do we have a video camera? Um, yeah, it's already set up. It is? It's right here. Okay, cool. I think it's Grant. Hey Grant, can you uh, can you move the door for us? Can you show us the sign? Thank you. 
I wonder if he moved. Because I'm not really. Oh! He's done hunting. Did Cat make it? You alive? I am. Activity's at a zero right now. I'm gonna see if there's any orbs. What'd you say? The brim is in the way of like, yeah, the shelf. Yeah, I don't know. But I mean, maybe we'd still see orbs. I think it cuts off about half the screen, but we might still be able to. Um, Hecate, you can watch for orbs if you'd like to. I want to go back in and go look for UV. Maybe we should move the camera as well. Because it would be yeah. faster maybe if you could holler to us if there are orbs. Plus, you'll regain sanity. Welcome to the channel memberships, our sick ghost. Thank you, thank you. If I see anything, I'll let you know. Slay. It's definitely still down here. Can you write in the journal, please? That was so sad. Uh, no. They should take a photo of my body. Hopefully Cap remembers to do that. He's up here. I can hear it. Up here being a freaking menace. Are those pet bulls? Is there a cat that lives here? That's kind of cool. You know, even though, like, I don't think, I don't think EMF ever did get to five, though. So I guess it depends whether or not they end up finding ghost orbs or anything. I'm going to follow Cap around. <laughs> Cap's running outside. Cool. I uh, have it on the floor. Oh, there we go. There we go. Let's see oh, there's orbs. orbs. Where? I don't see anything. Oh, yeah. That's an orb. Where? Hooray. Oh, yeah, there is an orb. Slay! Wait, we did it! It's an Onryo! We, wit oh, we, we witnessed a ghost event, so it's really weird that uh, it says that we didn't. But we did everything else. I got it, Cap. I got it. Uh, I got it. I think I can't pick up shit in here. Perfect. I'm going back in the house, Cap. I'm staying here to haunt it. <laughs> I gotta keep haunting. I'm gonna call them three, two, one. No, don't! I was just getting a coffee. Now I have to stay here and haunt it forever. This town ain't big enough for the two of us, Grant. We did it! I'm terrified yeah, we in that did it. I was trying to I had looped him successfully one time around the truck. And I was trying to loop him again in the basement and then ran directly into him. 
I, I truly, truly thought I would do it. Well, My chat keeps saying that the EMF was at a five. It's It definitely wasn't, though, because it wasn't evidence. I kept getting threes. Yeah, same. Everyone kept saying EMF jumped up to a five, but I never saw it, and it it had to be. Um... It could have glitched. You never Maybe. Well, that was so much fun. Thank you guys for playing with me. Yeah. Thank you for inviting Thank yeah, you guys so much. Of course. I can't for believe my very we first won ever one. experience. Yay! <laughs> Truly Yay. braver than anybody I've ever known in my life. Right. I'm so proud of you guys. Okay, I'll talk to you both after stream. Thank you so much. Okay. Bye. Bye. You're welcome. Love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> that was so fun. Oh, EMF goes to five during hunts. Oh, that's, that's really actually clear. so good to know. Because I definitely have written down five before. Um... And never, um, a, 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 like, maybe just got lucky that it went to five during a hunt. I didn't realize that. Um, oh, Ellie! Ellie Stoy! Sorry, honey, I don't know if you're still here, but uh, thanks so much for your super chat. Thanks for good vibes last Sunday and have a good week. Love you so much, Ellie. I hope that your new job is going well now. Oh, Static, we're killing it. The next time you end up playing, we're going to be so good. We're going to be so good. We're going to win so much. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. Long stream tonight, but I had a blast. Thanks for hanging out during our little sleepover. I think it stopped raining, too. Did it? That's, like, drizzling. The dogs will be able to go outside. That's good. Okay, fun. Slay. Thank you guys so much for a great stream. I'm going to go make some dinner and hang out and all that stuff. Um, but what a fun way to spend our Sunday. I loved it so much. I had a blast. Thank you so much for, um, for coming and playing with me, Cap and Hecate. I had so much freaking fun. It was a blast. Honestly, Cap carried, but <laughs> on, I, I think we're getting better and better. I think we're getting better and better. I think like, honestly, Faz is getting just like easier and easier. Um, but loved our little horror movie marathon. Loved our horror games, of course. Thank you guys for hanging out with me for so long. I love you, love you, love you. I'm going to go eat some dinner, and I will see you later this week with a new video. And hopefully, Static, I am giving you a hug. I love you very much. I can't wait to play next time. Um, but, yeah. Eee, I had so much fun. Thank you, guys. Going to go have my girl dinner. Girl dinner. Okay. Love you. Bye. Oh, Amanda, thank you so much. Good night, my love. Good night to you.